And welcome back to something that actually fucking works. I wouldn't be so angry at the game if it wasn't working before. It was kind of working. I mean, when I was moving around and you saw the buttons being repeatedly pressed, that was my controller. That wasn't me doing it. I mean, I don't even know what button you're supposed to push to bring up the menu. I'm sure it's pretty easy to figure out, though. Alright. So now we're live, and... What the hell? That's not what I want. <coughs> what I wanted to do was play some more stories in PFE. There is another game that's free from Epic Games that I might try out, but I'll probably try it out on my own just to see if it's any good first. But uh, this is the one I wanted to try out here. I have it sorted from newest to reverse. The newest in reverse, so this will be from oldest to newest. And yes, I figured out how to not have the carousel, which is super nice. This is a very long story. I favorited every single one of these so that I could just go to the favorites and find them. Uh, everything made by Decagon here, I believe, is part of the story. And I looked up Crystalid because that is the name of the race that you're supposed to be in these stories. So even though I have more in my favorites, it's only going to show these. It has to do with Crystalid Fleet. Now, I have played this one before, and I gave up on it early. But I played it last night, and it is beatable. It's very tricky but incredibly fun at the end, and it feels incredibly satisfying to actually beat it. So, we're gonna go ahead and beat it. Oh, this looks different. So here we go. So here it says, On the lookout for some sign of Saloi activity, since their awakening, the Crystallid fleet find a small Galcorp task force conducting shady operations within a particulate infested asteroid field <clears throat> and like i said i know how to beat this one because i have beaten it it does take a long time it's probably gonna take me less time now because i kind of know what i'm doing but the first things first that you have to know is never and i repeat never ever underestimate the omni cannons like omni cannons can be your best friend curious we do not recognize these ships, but the question is, are they friendly? Wait, I can sense an incoming transmission. Unknown entities, you are interfering in the business of the Galactic Corporation. Leave this place immediately. Humans, we do not mean any harm. Do you not remember us? Have we been asleep for that long? I haven't the foggiest idea what you're on about. I say again, leave now before I lose my patience. Transmission cuts off abruptly. Strange, the humans have sent out a signal that activated the nearby emitters. Perhaps we have no choice but to fight. Here goes. Give me a second here. Okay, <coughs> okay so they have activated the nearby emitters. And as you can see, this is the map. Obviously, we start up here. Um, it's a little tricky at first, for sure, because you get attacked by a lot of stuff. I mean, there's doppels down here. There are stunners over here. This massive stunner fed by emitters that you can't kill because they're shielded, as you can tell. Um, it looks fairly simple right now. Because you're just like, oh man, you could just land on all the... No, it's not that easy. There's a whole bunch of enemies struck as well. But the easiest thing that I think to do at first is you grab Omni Reactors and you grab Omni Cannons. And then I usually go with the move build speed increase. Because you're going to have to build your fleet real quickly. But for right now, what we want to do is we want to build Omnis to be able to take these lands over. You just have to make sure they're inside the ring of energy. That should be fine. <coughs> we won't do too much. We gave them cannons so that they can help defend, because oof, you are going to have to defend, like, super quickly. We'll try and go over here and grab some of these energy pods. The energy pods are going to be super useful. 
And then once those Omnis are built, we'll pause real quick. Good. Okay. And they have their reactors, so they should get energy relatively quickly. We're going to get a couple of these chip ships. These are just ships that have... Um, they pretty much have basic... A couple of basic lasers. I think they might have a particle beam. No, they have four basic lasers and two cannons. They're they're not amazing, but they're easy to build. <coughs> or at least somewhat easy to build. Main our main defense is gonna be Omnis. For a little bit. We're just waiting to unmire this land. And to kill the auto mirers. Once you kill that, you get the new ship. The new ship design here. A couple of these other ships are really nice too, but can't really do too much with them right this instant. <coughs> I'm sorry if I have to clear my throat. Like, my, my throat is really freaking bugging me right now. I don't know what its problem is. It might have been all the... Yeah, it might have been the eggnog that I had. Maybe it wasn't good for my throat. Anyway. Ah, what do we get next? I think... Hmm, I'm trying to think of what's going to be good. I think the mine production increase is probably... Well... No, because I don't think we're going to get another amp gem for a while. So I think what we'll do is we'll do energy range increase. Because we're going to get more energy from the land as well. We'll get one more gem, and that's probably going to be the mine production increase, more than likely. Oh god. Oh jeez. So much. Okay, this is when we need more Omnis. Like I was saying. What the hell was that weird noise? I don't like it. Like I said, we're going to try and build many more Omnis here. Because the Omnis are going to really help us with defense as well. Oh god. No, 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 no. Not the headquarters. These Omni cannons do help out a lot though, so let's go ahead and put them out here. You do kind of have to wait for them to come online though. We got one more Omni. Ah! The diamond, a powerful shard indeed, built for the purposes of deflecting space debris in the path of our fleets. It will be well suited to absorbing particulates. So yeah, the diamond is your absorbing ship. I think I want to build the amethyst because it's got stronger cannons. This will be a much better defender. But as you can see, things are already starting to get a little bit better. Do we have anybody that has any particle beams? The shard does. Yeah, I'll, I guess I'll get this chip shard, I think is what it's called. Because we need the particle beams to try to repair the plasma, if at all possible. Get that mine production increased. Now see, it looks like it's going to be tough, and it's not easy, for sure. What I usually like to do is try to sneak an Omni down here. They'll try and keep this struck pretty much at bay. You sneak an Omni down here, because this isn't getting mired too badly, so it should be able to mire it itself, and it kills this emitter rather easily. And then you don't have to worry about so much coming from the south, at least, which is quite nice. This emitter is, is a tough son of a bitch. It's really hard to get this one. So don't fall for that. But now with this one dead, that's that uh, helps relieve relieve the pressure here, just a smidge. We're gonna try and move these chip ships up a little bit further so that the particle doesn't get in. And then we'll move this guy right about there, and build another Omni right about here. Like I said, I feel like the key to this episode is just those Omni Cannons, for real. The Shard is going to be necessary, because that's our lathe. The Resonator is going to also be necessary, because this is our gas ship. And we'll also get to work on building the Diamond. 
And now it's basically just a matter of waiting. We'll try and get another couple chips out here. We'll try and build everything but the Starfire because this thing is massive and it's very slow, so it takes a lot of resources to build it as you would know as you would imagine. And since it's gonna take a lot of resources to build it, may as well just wait a bit. Let me see if this stream is working. Yeah, it seems to be working. Good. I was just making sure, because I kind of, you know, cut out and then went back in and stuff. I may have to look up on Google what's wrong with the messenger. Why is it not letting my controller work? I mean, if I wanted to, I could just use Joy to Key, but I shouldn't have to use Joy to Key. Oh, this is going to be nasty. I forgot I didn't get the stunners, or I didn't get the disruptors on my mines, so that's not going to be super fun. This is the next one I usually go for. There's a couple of places where you can actually send your omnis to do the dirty work, but right now, not much. So we're just waiting for the diamond. I'd love to take this energy mine, but it's not really feasible right now. And some of these things do turn into gems, so it's not like this one and this one are the last gems. You will, or this one as well, you will get plenty of gems in here. But it's, it takes a little bit of time to get this done. Because you gotta make sure everything is ready before you strike out. I'm gonna put the resonator here. We'll put the diamond out here. Because I want to try and block stuff. And then put this one here. And then we're gonna try and go in with the lathe. This is a bad idea. I'm gonna try it. Is he still yeah, he's still within energy range. This is gonna be nasty because it is going to try to get that lathe. Oh, it's drying. Good thing the lathe has a lot of lasers. It really does have a ton of lasers. Like, you can see those lasers really working hard. And the lathe is looking pretty good for energy-wise. You basically just want to keep an eye on the energy. Because if it starts running low on energy, you're going to be in big trouble. There we go. Okay, so this energy mine is a little bit harder to get. It is doable, but it is a bit tricky. So I'm going to try putting him here. I'm going to try putting the diamond, like, right here. And put you over here. There may be a couple of times where you are going to lose a ship. It is pretty much inevitable. But I'm trying to make this diamond just be a wall to protect this energy mine for now. I'm going to take their energy mine, bring it to my own... And then that should keep us pretty safe. Yeah, relatively safe, I'd say. And then what I might try and do is build the Starfire, like, here. The Starfire is great, too, because it has disruptors of its own. Yeah, that's going to stun that one. That's fine. Oh, I don't like that doppel. Oh, the diamond died. Are you freaking kidding me? Well, that's not great. That's not great at all. Yep, now they're going to kill the energy mine. Of course. But I can try and keep it up. Up and running as much as possible. It just, it does really suck when the diamond dies. Let's try and get these chips down here, see if they can maybe help out. Are they outside the energy range? They are. That's unfortunate. But if we can get that energy mine back up, there we go. Perfect. Okay, that should work for now. We'll just build this Starfire for now. The Starfire and the Diamond. The Starfire takes a long time to build, but that's because it's basically a base. <clears throat> for the most part, it's a base. Oh, please don't kill my mine, you bastards. And you can't take this emitter, trust me, I've tried it. It will just 
devour your lathe. I'm gonna try and put the lathe a little bit closer so that its lasers can help out. Damn it. Same with this ship, which I think is the Amethyst. Yep, yep. That it is. Now see, that's the problem with putting the diamond so close. I should put it like right here, maybe. But the diamond makes a great wall. And it has a couple of lasers, it has a couple of cannons. Oh, that dobble. That dobble's gonna be a pain, isn't it? It looks like it might be. Let's just move these guys in a little bit closer as well. Offer a little bit more firepower. Please do not kill that ship. I would appreciate it if you didn't. Could you maybe not? Yeah, get out of here, Doppel. These guys aren't doing too much, so I'm going to probably pull most of them and put them over here to protect against the Doppel. Maybe put one over here. But you don't want them moving through the Struck, where they're going to take, like, immense amount of damage. More damage than you would like them to take, that's for sure. Now, the base, the Starfire, also has Disruptors. I love the fact that when your headquarters get stunned, you don't lose your energy. That is super nice. I, I really appreciate that. <sighs> okay, now what I normally do is I go for this one. And it's not fun, the way to go for this one. It's very difficult. But it is doable. This Doppel is not even going to know what hit him. He is not going to have a good time. So you better run, dude. You better run. You are not going to have a good time here. And just think about it. The Starfire isn't even completely complete. Well, actually it is. It just needs energy. But this thing is great. It's shielded. It has energy. It has disruptors, it has missiles, it has cannons, it has lasers, it kind of has a little bit of everything. <clears throat> Which is very nice. Oh god, a diamond. Seriously? Seriously, diamond? You're gonna do this to me again? Really? Okay. Well, it's not gonna be the end of the world. Uh, you're gonna come over here... I'm going to move you over here. The diamond I'll probably put, like, right there. Damn it. You go over there. Diamond. Go over here. I don't want you to die. I'm not going to worry about this energy mine. It isn't really going to be that useful right now. They can take it back, it's fine. It's not that big of a problem, really. And they will, they'll, they'll kill it for sure. We can try and just, like, hold the Starfire here for a bit. Actually, the Starfire might be able to keep that safe. Maybe. It might be possible. It might be enough firepower to keep this energy mine safe. Because we're going to need all the cannons we can get. Oh, please kill that Doppel. Please kill it. Please kill it. Please kill it. Sweet. Okay, so next thing I do is go down here and kill this Doppel spawner so we don't have to worry about it anymore. We won't have to worry too much about the particulate because it doesn't really care that much. But we kill the doppel spawner so we don't have to worry about it anymore. Then the next time we kill it is the last time. It looks like it's getting wrecked already. Lasers are wrecking it. Interesting. And done. Perfect. Then you pull back. Pull back just a bit. Now what we're trying to do is we're trying to get rid of this struck. So as you can see, we have the Struck pretty much gone now. So we can probably land a couple Omnis here. 
that should be safe. And since we have the move build speed up, they're going to move really fast. They're going to start miring, and that's going to kill this extra particle that touches the land. And hopefully they won't die. They might die. Yeah, they did die. That's unfortunate. Let's just move in another two, shall we? Stop it. There we go. And then once we get this mired, we can just build on these on this land. They're going to kill this auto mirer, and then it should be a lot easier for them to mire. Because they're not fighting anything except for the particle. And the particle's not incredibly powerful with its miring there. Yeah, see, now they're miring. This gives us a slight foothold, at least. And then what I had to do is sneak in here and get this, because this is a pretty overactive um, thing, and it really sucks to not do this with energy. Because our energy is over here. And there's a new ship. This is... I don't remember. Oh yeah, the splinter. Yeah, that's right. The splinter's the grabber, basically. Though not armed like our other vessels, the splinter has the unique capability of warping gravity around itself. Perhaps it can help us by pushing friendly particulate towards our foes. Mm-hmm. But that's not going to be too helpful right now, because I don't have any friendly particulate right this moment. But we will have some soon. And that's where these Omnis come into play. You're not doing too much. Let's bring you down here, too. So the Omnis are going to give us good defense, and I'm hoping they're going to break through this wall. I think I'm going to have this guy go right about here, so that he can start having his cannons reach here, too, I think. He may be busy killing Particulate, though. Which is not exactly what I was hoping for. But it it is fine. Now this emitter, like I said, this this emitter is a pain in the ass to get. It's probably one of the hardest. There are definitely harder ones, but it this is definitely one of the hardest ones. I think these guys are helping too much. I'll bring them down as well. Okay, so we've broken this wall away. This is usually when I know that I can go for this. Because what we can do is something like this. It kind of works. It's very, very close, though. And then maybe just move the diamond in here so that it doesn't take too much damage. The lathe doesn't, hopefully. The Omnis will help out, too. And if the diamond dies, I mean, it's not great, but it's not terrible either. Oh, that doppel, though, seriously. Seriously, though, doppel. Could you not? Could you, like, maybe not? Thank you very much. That's our particle now. Good stuff. Now we can move this guy down just a bit more so that he can help out. Our particle will start really helping out here. And then I'm thinking he's going to go over here. Grab that energy mine. We don't have to worry about it getting taken over by the enemy now because we have blue particulate here. And that should keep it safe for basically forever. Now we need to get rid of this doppel. I'm thinking maybe the cannon's going to be the best way, probably. And then the funny thing is, you've got the energy to just be able to kind of sneak in behind this doppel, doppel, and then just kill his doppel spawner. And you don't really have that much opposition. Don't make me bring my chips in here. They're not very good ships, but I'll bring them in if I have to. Once his spawner's dead... He should die in peace. There we 
go, good to go. You can hear this thing going crazy with its disruptors. I usually leave this one here so they can protect the base and protect the HQ. And of course by base I mean protect the, uh, the energy mine, the main energy mine. Okay, now the next thing to do is I'm going to bring the diamond up here because I need it to be out of the way. And I'm going to build the splinter. I'm going to have it aim... Do I normally go for that? I think I do. I'm going to have it aim like right up here. It's going to seem strange that it aims that high, but it will help in the long run with getting rid of this emitter. This emitter is a nasty, nasty thing. I don't like this emitter. This one is really hard to beat. But having that splinter will help a lot, because what he's going to do is he's a grabber, see? He's going to throw all the particulate over here. It's going to kill the struck. And it's going to allow us to get in there and get some work done. Kind of like this. Hopefully this should work. We need to bring this guy in just a little bit further. There we go, there we go. No, I lost my lathe, damn it. See, this is, it's rough. It's definitely a rough emitter. Yep, there goes the lathe. Damn, I lost the whole entire ship, good lord. Wait, no I didn't. No, oh, I thought I did. I thought that's what that explosion was, but I guess not. Oh, sh oh shoot, that's what it was. Oh crap, that's not good. He's still in the energy range though, he should be fine. See, it bounces it like this, I hate it. I don't know why it curves like this, because it doesn't really help that much, but we're getting the emitter anyway. We've got enough pressure on it at least. Let's go get this mine back for ourselves. They're trying to attack the splinter, which I can't have. That is very important. This ship is probably the most integral ship in here, I would say. Well, I mean, besides the lathe or something. But you need this ship. Next, we're going to have it launch over there. This is going to launch a ton of the anti-particulate right at this island. And the idea is to get in here and start ripping it apart. See? It's already going to tear apart the struck. Oh, that's not great. Damn it. That's not great at all. God dang it, you dumb particulate. I'm going to move a chip down here just to help. It's not a whole lot of defense that's really necessary, but it would be nice to have some defense at least. What? You have no freaking energy. Those are so stupid. Here, take some energy and get that energy mine, please. There, see, now you got energy. Isn't that, isn't that nice? I think I'll just put the diamond here for now. <coughs> Create a wall. Now the trick is, I usually like to go in here. Um, let's see if I can get this guy to be in a good spot. That should be fine. I usually like to go in here and grab this gem. I don't like right now. Because if you can grab this gem, then you can put a Omni there. You can land two Omnis. But if you don't grab the gem, you can't land two Omnis. <laughs> Good. Back up, back up. Alright, and then what do I want with the gems this time? I think it's about time to get the mine discharge. Well, no, let's get the Medina Emergent. Benign Emergent can help us push. I think that's what I got here anyway, usually. So we're going to take two Omnis. This does take a little bit of time. See? You can land them right there. <coughs> this does take a bit of time, though, because... They're going to take damage, probably from Struck, probably from Cannons, probably from the Energy Mine, but they can kill the Cannon. 
They can mire, they might die though. Oh. Oh, they're looking good. They killed the cannon. <coughs> or the gun, or whatever you want to call it. We're miring beautifully. Sadly, they can't take this energy mine though. And this emitter is not as bad as it looks, because it looks really bad here. But it's really not that bad. I mean, it's not something. It's nothing that this thing can't handle. <clears throat> Just get it firing those cannons. Shit. Freaking stuns, are you kidding me? Really? Are you serious with this? Not even getting energy. How is it not getting energy? It's right there. Maybe it can't get energy while stunned? It's just dumb. Well, that's probably not necessary to be up there anymore. Even though we don't want to have the mine disruptors yet, but I could grab this gem. I might as well just do that. I think that's what I did before, too. Because I realized once you grab that other gem, you can just grab this one pretty easily. There's really no fight to it. And then with that, we'll probably grab Mind Disruptors. Or Mind Dischargers, I mean. There we go. <clears throat> Good to go. And then we'll take a couple of these Omnis and land them here. It should be relatively safe. They might hit a couple of things that are not great. Uh, we'll set the Emergent Rally Point here. With my 9 Emergent right there. And honestly, we'll move this guy just a smidge so that he is just launching directly into this mess here. That'll be perfect. These guys are miring just fine. We lost one Omni, but that's not the end of the world. We'll gain one more Omni, too. Now, see, the thing that makes this tricky is the fact that most of the islands are all covered in Struck, which makes it very hard to get to. You can move the fortress, it just takes a really long time to move. It has no boosters. None at all. Like, there's no boosters on this thing. So it's, like, super slow. It's as slow as it can possibly be. Uh, do I dare get in there with a lathe? Do I try? I mean, there's a lot of blue particulate. There's also the emergent. I'm gonna give it a shot. Come on, lathe. You can do it. You got the energy? I don't know, maybe it doesn't have the energy? I'm gonna try and make sure it has the energy. There we go. And it failed. Just too much emergent. I mean, particle. Not emergent. Damn it. Damn it, my lathe is stunned too. Are you freaking kidding me? Well, I'm gonna lose the lathe for sure. Oh, well, maybe not. Maybe not. It is just barely alive. Get into the energy. So I feel like this guy needs to aim a bit lower. For, for some reason, it doesn't seem to fire per, uh, perfectly. See, it's still getting stuck. Well, he's actually not on the thing anymore, so that could be a problem. I like that. It still seems to drift. Which I guess that means I should probably send him, like, down here. That way when it drifts, it'll kind of drift up and it'll just cover that whole mass there. Okay, that's working out pretty well. Diamond can not only eat the particulate, 
but it can actually fight the particulate too, so it's all good. I would really like to get some defensive struck, but the next gem is over here, so that's going to take a little bit of time. You piece of trash. If I move this guy in a little bit further, he might be able to start attacking that doppel. I'm going to do it. Even though I know he won't have energy all the time, he's going to try and attack that doppel, I think. I could certainly use the help. God, this is not good for the diamond. Okay, so now set the emergent rally point here. And let's see if we can just destroy some stuff. Should I go for it? Well, I could do it. I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna back him off just a smidge. See if I can just fit the lathe in here. Just hope for the best. Oh, they're gonna react though. They're going after the diamond, which is good. Should bring in a couple of chips, too. That's not a chip. But I do need him for his dischargers. Well, I've got one chip. And it's dead. Good. Perfect. Okay, so now what we can do is get rid of the struck and then kill this doppel creator. Now I can move the fortress in much closer, because this should be safe now. It should be relatively safe, I think. Oh god. That doppel's really trying to kill me. Oh, it's getting freaking wrecked now. It's getting fried. You fried doppel. Yes, fry it, yes! And it's not going to be able to remake itself. Perfect. Alright. Pull that back to the back lines. And then what I like to do is, since this fleet is really super annoying, I like to put my emergent rally point, like, right here on this energy mine. It will tear up the fleet in, good, in due time. And then I'm thinking about where I want this guy to shoot his blue stuff. I'm thinking right here at this thing might work. It should relatively get it in there. Now the next place to go is probably going to be up here. The tricky thing is actually making it work. gonna try and land four Omnis here and see if we can mire this land away. It's just, it's a slow and steady pace kind of thing. Get that auto mirer and then we can start miring real easily and we might not even lose an Omni. Well, we might lose this one. Yep, we lost him. That's fine. Again, not the end of the world. This cannon is so busy trying to unmire this land, it just, it can't do it just can't do it. I have the mind disruptors, right? Yes, good. That will help out a lot. That'll help out with the stunners, even though the stunners aren't too bad. There's only six, and they come like every 140 seconds or something like that, so it's not, not the end of the world. For sure. So you can already tell they're having a really hard time with the particulate and the, uh, the emergent. They're having a really tough time. Which is okay with me. Oh, I gotta be careful here. There's no way that you can get anything with the Omnis here. It looks like it, but it's it's deceptive. You can't. Now what I could do, and I'm gonna give it a shot. Probably a bad idea, but I'm gonna try. Fly, 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 fly gonna hit a, a particulate. Oh, it missed it. Good. Land. There we go. This will kill the gun. That 
that will make it a little bit easier. It should be able to easily mire this land, not a problem. Now the energy mine has nothing to um, feed, which is good. We could try and come around and try and take this, but it's really not that easy. So what I usually like to do is bring in a couple of chips for their cannon fire. Just for a bit of defense. And then bring the diamond up here. And the amethyst, because we're going to need that. We'll probably leave this chip down here just to help defend. Should be fine. We'll need the tanker for sure. Bring it up here, the resonator. And we're definitely going to need this light. So I'm probably going to put it like right here. <clears throat> now the idea is we want to try and take that energy mine as quickly as possible. So I'm thinking the easiest way to do this is to block all this particulate with the diamond, get this in here, get the resonator in here, See? just like that. Get the chips in for some backup so the diamond doesn't, hopefully doesn't die. Oh god. God, that's a lot of stuns. I don't like it. Oh, my lathe. My lathe got caught. That's not great. Okay, so now we can move these guys over. These beautiful, beautiful Omnis. Build a couple more, why not? So they can help with this, because this emitter goes kind of out of control, as you can tell. It goes a little bit crazy. But now we've got this cannon helping out too, so that's good. Now this emitter is possible to get. Usually what I do is go like this. Oops. Something like this. Oh god, the diamond died. Are you freaking kidding me? That's not good. Damn it. The fucking diamond died. If it wasn't for the diamond dying, that would have been fine. Because they'll, they'll attack the diamond most of the time. If you don't get too close to it, it won't go completely berserk. I did also beat that one yum level too, the one that I thought was impossible. It is very hard though, and it takes a lot of pausing. Because you have to pause and give many, many orders at the same time. Because you only have like 2 minutes and 14 seconds before you're totally boned. I think I can grab this gem, can't I? Yes, I can grab that gem, that's good. I could also kill this thing if I wanted to, which might not be a bad idea. I think I did do that before, I believe. But see, you can see that they can keep this at bay pretty well. There we go. That should take care of that, hopefully. No. Gotta be the other way around. Spin it! There we go, yep, spinning. Alright, diamond. Instead of creating a complete wall this time, I'm just gonna have you like this. We've got everybody nice and tight in here to help. Kill that Mirer there. Grab these guys and bring them over here. Grab you and bring you over here as well, because they're probably going to need some help miring. I'm sure. Fairly certain. Damn it. Amp gems. Uh, probably going to go for defensive struck now. Just to protect these mines a little better. Okay, let's see if we can just kind of sneak in here now. That looks like it might work. Yep. Now it's going to go crazy, but most of it's going to hit the the diamond, which is our lucky. It's lucky for us, anyway, I should say. See? 
even when the emitters are kind of crazy like this, you can beat it. You just have to be strategic with it. And then we got that down. Let's go grab this message. There are no more emitters except for this one flip emitter. Well, I mean these, but you can't get those. They're indestructible. They're just part of a, a weird structure. This thing. This is a Siloy structure. Its original function was to supply energy to all ships in the sector. Unfortunately, it appears its function has been corrupted to produce stunner orbs. The armor is impregnable. How did it become corrupted? So, I think the stunner is also indestructible. I didn't actually try to kill it, though. You know what? I'm going to give that a shot. Let's see, because you can land right here. You have to make sure to give this waypoints, though, because if you touch any of this, this is concentrated particulate. Can you kill that stunner? No, I didn't think so. All right, never mind. Oh, I need to make, make sure to give it waypoints, because if it touches that emitter, like, it, it is just dead. Okay, and then what I did is I usually slipped some Omnis over here to help out, but it doesn't look like I have very many Omnis left. Well, I got these two. They're not really doing much of anything. Now, you can only fit two over here, and you got to be really careful with them. I'm going to try and move the base in a little bit further so that it can start really putting some pressure on these guys. Even though it doesn't do a massive amount of damage, it does enough. Now i got to hopefully get these guys over here. I'm going to build an Omni over here just to admire. Go, go, go! Down, down, down! 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 Oh! Ooh, I don't know. I don't know about that. Is it going to be enough? Uh, nope. Nope, not gonna be enough. It might be enough for one Omni, though. Yeah, it looks like he's okay. Which means you can now land over here relatively safely. And then we can just rebuild an Omni here again. No big deal. Careful. Don't get shot by cannons or missiles. Down, down, down. Okay. Once they land, they can't get hit by anything. Even the miring cannons don't hit them. It just mires the land that they're miring. It's annoying, but it's not the end of the world. Okay, diamond, come on down here. Where's my amethyst? There you are. I'm gonna get you to come right about here. And these ships are really well built, too. One, they look very cool. They look like a different alien kind of ship. And two, they're harder to kill than main ships because they have floating parts, which I wasn't even sure that was a thing you could do, but apparently it is. Okay, so now we gotta kill these ships. If we kill them, they do not come back. So it's gonna take a little bit of time, but it can definitely be done. One of the easier ways is trying to get that flip emitter, but I would not recommend it with all these ships here. You have to destroy them. But as you can tell, I mean, they're, they're taking some damage. That cruiser is almost dead. And it is out of range, I think. Damn. Where's my tanker? There you are. I'm going to need my tanker as well. I'm going to put him right down here. He's super important. We're going to try and push everybody out a little bit further. I think one of them died. And that was not my ship that died. That was one of theirs. Nice. Yeah, they're dying. Oh, yeah, they're dying. Oh, yes. There we go. Very nice. Now, the particulate here gets pretty annoying. Let's see, that's going to give me enough room, maybe. Can I get my lathe in there? I don't think I can. 
We're gonna have to push a little bit further. I have a feeling this guy is not in the energy, so get back there. That resonator has to be able to feed them. Where does it go to? Okay, yeah, that should be fine. Because I well, should be able to put it, like, right there. That should be fine. And then once we get this, it's pretty much over. Because this is going to flip and it's going to give us these spaghetti ones for ourselves and it's just going to wreck everything here. Just have to be careful and make sure that lathe is not going to die. And boom, done. See? Just like that. And now there's no more red particle to worry about once it's dead. Nice. And we can try and take this energy mine. There goes their headquarters. Boom, we got the energy mine. And now all of it's left is just taking this. And that's it. There's nothing else you can do. This is the end of the level. Let's see. Told you it was beatable. And I did much better than last time. It took me like an hour last time because I had so much trouble with some of these emitters, but I found the best way to deal with them. Like the emitter that was here I had such a hard time with this because I tried to deal with it this way, but it's not a good idea to deal with it this way because you have no energy here. Whereas if you can break this part of the struck and come in, you can use this energy mine to just have energy. Which is nice. Almost done. Oh, right. I was looking at the enemy particulate. I'm like, why is there still enemy particulate? Oh yeah, that's because the particulate up there. The emitters that are just... that ju They're just showering out badness. I wonder if I could get my headquarters over here to, to help lay it, but I don't think it's going to make it in time. This thing does take a very long time to lathe. A very long time. But once we play the next level, I won't know what to expect at all. Oh, it did actually come over here. Nice. These are the only two lathes you get. The humans have been eliminated. But what? But was this loss of life worth it? What were they doing here? So many mysteries, so few answers. Perhaps we should check out this galactic corporation. And there we go. So that'll do this one. Like I said, this is my best time now. So that's the first one, I believe. And I think you can do this in order of numbers here. Like this is 624, 638. So I'm imagining... I'm trying to figure out how they do this. They do it like that, 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 that. Or is it like this, 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 this? Oh, I think it's this way. Yeah, it's got to be that way. Yeah, because it's this way. Okay. So then the next one would be this one. This is Jericho Station. Following the trail of transmissions from the destroyed Galcorp fleet back to a military hub, the Crystalids are yet again given no quarter by the humans. Warning. This map contains a ship many times larger than normally allowed. Even though I have not encountered any issues, play at your own risk. Oh boy. Uh, this thing maybe? <laughs> oh boy, well, uh, let's give it a shot, shall we? <laughs> this could be really difficult. We have arrived at the source of the Galactic Corporation transmissions. A large station is attempting to hail us. Unidentified vessels, you have entered a restricted sector. 
As per Galcorp military regulations, all, un un all, all unauthorized craft will be destroyed on site. Humans, we did not know the significance of this location. We mean you no conflict. Allow us a few moments to charge our rift engines and we will withdraw from this sector. I cannot allow you to do that. An official apology from Galcorp for your unfortunate fate will be sent to your homeworld once your remains have been catalogued and your homeworld has been found. Enemy vessels are plentiful here. We must be careful. We are in luck, however. We have managed to excavate an ancient Catalyst class command shard out of one of the planetary bodies in this system. It will supplement our fleet nicely. Uh -huh. It's another HQ, look at that. This one must be what they're talking about. The Catalyst is the crystallid uh, equivalent of many other corporations HQ ships, providing a suitable command node through which the fleet is directed. Unlike most other HQs, however, the Catalyst is uniquely able to not only work separately from energy mines, but is also able to use its port module to construct ships in dire low-energy situations. Oh, well, that's interesting. It is clear now that these humans are not the Saloi, and shall be considered hostile to us. We must destroy their station if we are to escape this sector. Perhaps then they shall see the error in their methods. Alright. So there's going to be a shitload of ships here. Oh, this thing is humongous. That is really scary. Okay, so this looks like a city. Is there ship plans? There's something here. This looks like it's supposed to be a gun. Like a big old cannon. And if I activate this, it's just going to explode with blue particulate. Which sounds pretty cool. Doppel creator, enemy ship creator, bunch of auto wirers, couple of emitters. Where the hell am I supposed to start? Oh my god, I start here. Oh good lord. Well. That doesn't seem like it's gonna be particularly fun, although look at this. New ships. Another ship over here too. Hmm, okay, so there's a couple of flip emitters in here too. I like that. How bad are these things? Oh! Oh boy. Well, this one looks particularly weaker, so I would probably want to go for that one first. Now, can this ship see everything with its lathe? No. It can't. Now, do I need my corporate HQ as well? I don't know. Am I not supposed to have the corporate HQ, maybe? We're definitely going to go with Omni Reactors and Omni Cannons at first, and we'll definitely go with this as well. And I think that might be it for now. And then it was saying that this ship can build Omnis, so I'm going to build a cup. What? You can't build there, really? Surprising. I'm going to build one right about here as well, so that it can just take the rest of this. I have an auto mirer, but I mean, that's not really going to help much. But I would like those amp gems for sure. Alright, let's see if this thing can really build. It does, it just doesn't build super great. But we've got energy now, so that's good. It's got some decent weapons on it, that's for sure. Now we've got the Omnis helping out. There, it's starting to build a little better now. We've got a nice energy storage here. And we can get these energy mines, no problem. What the hell is this thing? I don't like that. I don't like that at all. So the green ring, I think, is its energy ring. So I'm going to try and build some chips here to help out with some defense. Just two for now. Should be simple enough. Got some more amp gems. I could try and amp this. Oh, why not? 
Yeah, that gives even more range. That's awesome. It might actually build faster as well. I'm not sure. Oh god. Please don't kill the ships. They're not even built yet. Please. Have mercy. And there's like nowhere to put freaking Omnis. Seriously. Seriously. It's like nowhere to build Omnis. Okay, so it's not building anymore? Hmm. That is not great. There's the doppel. So why is it not building anymore? I've got energy, it's just not building. I feel like maybe it's because it ran out of energy itself. Let's destroy these, just get rid of them. Maybe that will help a little. I can't believe I can't land here. That is just surprising. Hmm. I mean, do I just go take an energy mine? Maybe. Maybe it's not that difficult. This thing is pretty damn fast. It's pretty damn defended. Oh god. It is definitely a headquarters though. It does make that noise. Not great. Oh, come on. Please. Please just take it. Really? Hold on. I'll try and pop in this corporate HQ too. What the hell? The lathes just aren't working. Oh, it's because I can't get in there. Hmm. Well, let's restart real quick. And we'll just skip the messages and stuff. Skip. I don't know what happened there, though. I guess it just has a certain amount of energy, but it has nothing right now. See, the bad thing is, there's just no energy here. Hmm. Well, let's see here again. Well, did I get Omni Reactors? I'm pretty sure I did. And then that. And then... Yeah, I'm not really sure what else to get. I don't think there really is much I can get. We do have the diamond and the amethyst again. See, it was weird. It just, like, ran out of energy. Even though I had tons of energy. It just freaking ran out of energy, and I don't know why. Because I think what it's supposed to do is it's supposed to build ships. And then we're supposed to go over there and take that mine. But we need more than just a single resonator. I mean, uh shard let's see if I can build it over here maybe see it's draining its energy reserves and then yeah it has its reactors but that's pretty much it And it sucks not having an energy mine, it really does. Oh my god. 
these energy mines are so... Well, there's only one energy mine, that's it. Just this one, that's it. This is awful. Because once it runs out of energy, it just gives up. build a resonator too. Which I have a feeling I can't do. Because he's just going to run out of energy, I think. Again. Maybe not. The doppels seem to be leaving me alone because I'm not building up here. Maybe that was the trick. I didn't even build an omni up there, so that might be the trick to it. I can't land an Omni on this place at all. So stupid. Oh no, doubles are coming. Raining energy, that's great. it's got some reactors so it can have energy it's just it's using all its energy for defenses sadly we need to build the shard too i just really really need to secure an energy mine Shoot, are you freaking kidding me? Stun's incoming now? Really? Really with this bullshit? Five stuns? Wait. What the hell's this thing? Weird. God damn it, now everything's fucking stunned. Which means pretty much everything's gonna die. Because it's going to be stunned for like a million years. I mean, I almost wonder if it's a better idea to just spawn in the HQ over here and try and flip this emitter, because it's not really that strong. Maybe the HQ can take it? Because this isn't fucking working at all. It's just not working. I don't like it. I don't like the idea at all, but I don't think I have much of a choice. Because this has to be in here somewhere, I'm sure. Let's see, if I put it down here... And like that, it should hopefully be able to take it. Build the Omni here so I can get the extra gems. I'm gonna hope, hope and pray, hope for the best. Hope it can keep itself safe. I mean, it's got lasers, it's got cannons. Hopefully it can do it. Come on, you can do it. HQ, I believe in you. I believe in you. You can do it. All you have to do is flip it, and then it's ours. And we never have to worry about it again. Shit, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Almost there, almost there. Got it. It's flipped. But we did flip it, so that's something. Which also means I can take this mine now. Thank God. Or at least I think I can. 
hope so. That doppel's awful close, I don't know. Yes, I know. I know, you're gonna be all pissy, I know. Okay, hold on. Now we'll pause and think of what we want. Let's see. I mean, we definitely get Omni Reactors, Omni Cannons, build speed, for sure. I think Defensive Struck might not be a bad idea. Let's go with Defensive Struck, Energy and Mine Production Increase. Now that we have a mine, we need all of this stuff really, really badly. <sighs> so I'm thinking we build some chips. Let's just build two. Of course, we're in this nasty plasma, which is not super fun. I'd like to be able to clear that out. The amethyst has some. We don't even. Oh, you do have particle beams. Okay, so. I'm thinking we get one of these and just start cleaning up. The defensive struck should help to protect my mine after a while here. Oh god, the HQ. The HQ, though, is seriously going to be a, in a bad way. Hmm, I think I'm... I don't know. Emitter control could be useful. I think I'm going to grab that, actually. Because then I can send the emitter directly this way. And once it starts powering up, it should do a lot of really good stuff. Oh my god, seriously, Doppel? Get out of here with your dumb bullshit. Actually, what I could do is build a whole crap... Damn it. Oh, you piece of absolute trash. Really? No, hold on. I'm gonna send it at the doppel, I guess. You know what? Let, let's just hang back. I don't want the, the headquarters to die. Let's just hang back a little bit. And once that particulate actually gets out there, we'll be able to rebuild this. God dang it. Stupid HQ. Because it should start getting there sometime. Actually, what I might do is just have it target like this. Have it push out and see if I can save the energy mine. Kind of build a wall of blue particulate. God damn it, you piece of shit. Get out of here. Stop going directly for my HQ. God, I hate this stupid shit. I fucking hate it so much. Stupid trash. Wait, it's not close enough, I don't think. It needs to be close enough to build the mine. Come on, build the mine! There you go. Good. We got it. Okay, good. That should help out a little bit. We'll start clearing up the plasma. We'll start having a little bit of defense here. Here soon, once they get their cannons. They've got their lasers, but they don't have the cannons yet. I think I'm, I'm thinking I'm gonna put one here. Perhaps one like right here. Okay, the struck is slightly up now. We've got almost full control of this, so let's see if we can send it right at that doppel. It'll start getting slowed down due to the plasma, but it will it, it will eat through the plasma over time. Oh yeah, and then I wanted to build some Omnis here. This way we could have a little bit of Omni help. God damn it. Seriously? Stupid freaking stunners! Yeah, see that doppel's gonna get eaten alive by the blue particulate. Or at least that's the, uh... That's the hope. That's the dream.
I think what I'm going to do with the headquarters is see if maybe I can sneak over here and kill this doppel generator. I'm hoping I can. Oh, he's trying to kill the headquarters, isn't he? That's not great. Why can't I build Omnis here? There we go. Build some Omnis so that I can have a little bit more defense. Also, I'm going to build a whole bunch of Omnis here. And by a whole bunch, I mean just two for now. That Doppel's a little close to that Omni, so that's a little scary. It should be fine. We're killing this Doppel Generator, which I think is his. Maybe this is his, I'm not sure. Good stuff. Get this over here. Now it's time to build the Amethyst, I think. We've got the Omnis helping out. As I said, I mean, look at those Omni Cannons. They are not to be uh, uh, underestimated. The Prism is one of our strongest shards. It has determination to match its guns. It will help face the enemy battleships on even terms. Oh, what is it? Oh! 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 Oh, I think I'm in love with that ship. Now send this over here. I'm going to try and move you up a little bit so you can start clearing out the plasma up here. That would be nice. They've got lasers to burn the missiles, which is good. We're not going to build the prism just yet, though. Not just yet. It's going to take a long time to build, so I'm not going to worry about it too much right now. Nami over there, that should be fine. Wait, can I build Nami here now? Yeah, it must have just been that one uh, power pod or whatever the hell they call them. Energy pod, that's what they call them, I think. Crap. These freaking stuns! God damn, these stuns. I hate them so much. We built a Starfire next. I think we build the Starfire next just for the epic uh, dischargers that it has. Because I'm, I'm sick of these stuns. I'm so sick of them. Well, this thing is getting absolutely wrecked. Look at him just get wrecked. Bring those cannons in here and start wrecking him. Just shoot him with all the cannons. Why is my headquarters getting touched? Oh, it's probably this one. Yeah, it's this one. It's fine. It's got plenty of armor. It'll live. Yes. Look at this thing just get devoured. I love it. Kill it. In fact, I can build more Omnis. Well, maybe just one. Try and move that Omni over there and build one more. Probably need to move this guy up just a smidge. Just so you can clear a little bit more of this plasma. Yeah, we're gonna hear that a lot because this guy's just gonna keep taking damage. But it's not a big deal. Gotta get that Starfire build. Oh, yes, there's a ship over here too. I almost forgot about that. Let's go grab this. No reason not to. There's no reason to have these guys here anymore, it seems like. Over here doesn't look particularly too dangerous. I mean, uh, kinda. These these are some weird-ass ships. This is a C-Class. A little bit dangerous. But, we have the Prism. And we're getting another one, which is a... Oh, it's another Shard. Interesting. Okay. That's cool. Wish I could get another one of these things. But that's just another lathe ship. Which is great, but... Eh. Shit. It's gonna... Yep, that's gonna shut my energy mine down, which fucking sucks. But what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do about it, right? 
What can you do about it? Not much. There we go, it's back. Would this thing, like, kindly die? That would be nice. Oh, is that a creator? I think that's a damn ship creator as well. But this ship just refuses to die. Good lord. Hold on. Let me move this guy out here a little bit more so he can clear some of this plasma a little bit more. Just clear out that plasma as much as you can, buddy. That way that blue particulate will just absolutely chew him up. Chew him up and spit him out. Can I get this thing to move? Eh. That'll do right there. Yeah, that is a builder. I thought it might be. Let me see if I can get the HQ in there. I hope it'll be somewhat safe at least. It'll be somewhat protected. It's got its lasers, it's got cannons helping out. Let's just kill this builder so we don't have to worry about that ship anymore. Then I'll withdraw the HQ for sure. I need to build these shards too. I'm gonna build both shards, I think. Just so we can maybe do some double lathing action in the future. Alright, withdraw. Withdraw to the back lines. Oh wait, that's a that's a freaking energy mine? What? I did not know this. No no no, don't with don't withdraw. There's an energy mine over here. Don't you dare withdraw. Get it. Ding! Aha! It has been gotten. And then I can land somebody over here and we can kill this. Uh-oh, I hear disruptors failing. Oh, it's because it's the Starfire. It doesn't have enough energy yet. Oh, no. Well, at least it did some damage. Because the thing about the stunners is the more damage you do to it, the less, the less time you'll be stunned. So since I did some damage to it, I won't be stunned as long. Okay, so we're definitely going to need to go up here. So the whole idea is to control this whole first area first. Which definitely makes sense. Alright. Headquarters, you're going to have to go back down here. I'm sorry, but you have to. I still feel like I don't have enough energy, though. Hmm, so does that mean this is going to become an energy mine as well? Maybe. I wonder if it's possible to land over there. Because this isn't truly mired that badly. Oh god. Ow! Nope. That didn't work out. Maybe this will work better? No, those freaking missiles, man. No, that's not happening. Alright, well it was worth a shot. We built those Omnis for the defense. It was worth a shot. Didn't work out, but it was, it was, you know, it was something. Not something good, but it was something. If I could possibly reach that. No. Eh, you could reach it from there, maybe. I mean, you can't land anywhere here except for there. You could land there, but that won't reach it either. I'm trying to reach this with an Omni. I think the only way is up here. I do believe. Oh look, it's got energy now. Now we can stop the stuns! Oh, I love it. Yes! Yes! Oh, the stuns are a thing of the past now, pretty much. Okay, should we build the prism now? I think we should. My god, this thing is huge. Bam. That thing is massively huge. But that's kind of what I expected, too. Alright. So let's bring you in here. You're gonna come over here. You're gonna come over there.
Because we're trying to do some damage here, if at all possible. Oh god, we're getting eaten. We are definitely getting eaten, aren't we? Maybe? I'm gonna move this guy out a bit. So he can start clearing up plasma and start helping out. Got a lot of weapons. Not very super strong weapons, but you know, some weapons. Not too bad. We should be able to take this guy out, shouldn't we? We took the other guy out. Oh, we uh. had the the help of this, that's right. Uh. I'm gonna try moving you here. I'm gonna try aiming this that direction. See what happens. I don't know if it's going to work or not, but we'll give it a shot. Get this guy in here so that he can start clearing some plasma. Oh. Prism's almost built. But for a big ship, it builds quite fast, doesn't it? Quite fast indeed. Yeah, we're gonna have to hear that a lot. Because the this HQ is taking some damage, but it's not taking a lot of damage. It has a lot of armor. A ton of armor. Oh, it's here. Oh, it is almost here. Okay, so for the MK7 of the cargo. Stop one ship. Oh, it has carriers too? Oh, I didn't even know that. Maybe I did. I don't know. Oh my god, there's so many freaking ships here now. I don't like it. Okay, I'm gonna park my butt back in here. I don't want to lose that HQ. If at all possible. Oh my god in heaven! What in the fuck? How are they just attacking me with everything now? What in the fuck? How is this fair? My ship's not even ready yet. I didn't expect them to fucking attack me with everything. Fuck. Well, I guess this is the end. Guess I should have built the prism faster, I suppose. God, they have MK7s like crazy! What the fuck?! Shit. What in the absolute fuck? Like, seriously. What in the fuck am I supposed to do about this fucking bullshit? There goes everything. Oh, gee, wow, that was super fucking fair. Super, super fucking fair. And now they're just gonna sit here like fucking dick faces. Right? They're just gonna sit here. Like the stupid little dick heads that they are. They're just gonna sit here. Well, what the fuck do I do now? Oh, well, I guess this one's unbeatable. I guess it's unbeatable. Seems unbeatable to me. Look at how many ships there are. Do you think you gave them enough goddamn ships? Do you think so? Because guess what? Even if I come out here and think that I'm going to be cheeky, and think I'll come out here and build a prism? Guess what? It's not gonna work. Oh, I can't even fucking build the HQ. Oh, well that's just glorious. 
That's just absolutely glorious. And now the HQ's instantly dead. Watch. Ready, set, dead. Instantaneous death. And then they're just gonna keep killing my particulate. Wow. Well, I guess that's the end of that story. I mean, if only the author didn't make it fucking impossible, then, you know, we'd have a chance. But apparently he just wanted to make it fucking impossible, I guess. Nothing I can do about it. Not my fault, he fucking sucks at making levels, apparently. I mean, I don't know what this thing is, either. I never did get this. I never could get it. It's fucking impossible. Do you see how many ships are here? You can't even count the number of ships because they're all just stacked on top of each other. How in the fuck is that fair? Just answer me. How the fuck is that fair? And when did that happen? Like 17 minutes in? What the fuck was I supposed to do? What in the absolute fucking hell am I supposed to do? Was I supposed to have the prism right away? I mean, maybe. But now, guess what? Now we have to restart the whole goddamn thing over again. Woo, isn't that super fun? Fucking horse shit is what it is. Shut up, I don't care about your goddamn story anymore. Oh, you can bet I'm fucking pissed off. I can't believe that. All that work just to get fucking destroyed. And where was that prism at? This is the prism. So I basically just need to get this as soon as possible. This is the only thing that's going to defend against those because it has, what was it, two MK7s? And I don't know what this is, but I need to get this too as fast as possible. I guess maybe it's just gonna take some pausing as well. I fucking hate playing the game with the pause strategy, but this is just gonna have to happen. We know that this works, but I think I do lose my headquarters. Which is fine, it's not a big deal. Come on. Come on, just get it. Done. Good. Could it get the energy mine too? If it could get the energy mine, that would be awesome, but I don't think it's gonna happen. I hate how fucking close these stupid ships are too. They're so goddamn close. And so are the doppels. They're so fucking goddamn close. It's just unfair. Please get that energy mine. God damn it! I hate it when you're trying to build something like this, and then something touches it, and it just immediately eliminates all your progress. Every little bit of progress. Okay, at least that's something. Let's go ahead and get an Omni going right about there. Should be safe, I think. That land is a little mired, but it's not the end of the world, I don't think. God damn it. Alright, pause. God damn it, there goes my fucking Omni. That's fine. Let's see. <sighs> Defensive struck. That one, that one, that one. Three gems left. This one, this one. Maybe instead of emitter control, because we do still have the splinter, I could use that as a form of emitter control, kind of. I think what I'll do is I'll go for the... The mine cannons really aren't going to help that much. Although maybe, I guess I'll go for it. Since this thing turns into a mine as well, I guess we'll go ahead and try. Of course, they fucked up this land. 
to the point where I can't make an Omni on it. Great. It's just lovely. Build those Omnis. And then... Let's see, do I just go for the Starfire right away, maybe? The Amethyst could help, too. But I think I do just build the Starfire right away. Build it way down here. Where it'll be safe. Did I get those dischargers? I did not get the mine dischargers. God damn it. Well, maybe I'll be okay once the Starfire gets up and running. Maybe. Uh, 100 seconds, it might be up and running by then. Now where the fuck did all those stupid goddamn ships come from? Anyway. Like, where did they come from? They're not here. Unless they get built from, like, here. Oh, it's just these guys, isn't it? Well, that's super fucking fair. Well, at least now that I know that that happens, I'll have the prism ready earlier. Much, much earlier. Let's see if we can just get this defense going. Let's see if we can get that struck build, that would be nice. Also, I'll probably build the splinter right here. Aim it directly at this douche nozzle. hope for the best that that's going to give me some defense. I'll build an Omni way the hell down here. Oh, you piece of shit. Yeah, don't even think about it, you dumb particulate. I'm going to go grab this one. I can't remember what this one was. This is not the prism, because the prism's up here. It does look like I can definitely build an Omni up here now, at least. At least that's something. Oh, this is another shard, that's right. Okay, got the shard. So that's miring. This is miring. I feel like building one more Omni here. I'm thinking about taking him over here and just seeing if he can get this. Because I don't know what that is, but I think I might definitely need it. My quick little Omni. Oh shit, the missiles. That's right. God damn. Fucking missiles. Of course, it has to be the goddamn missiles. Well, the Starfire is almost up and running, which is good. As long as those stray particulate don't end up killing it as soon as its command module is built, which could happen. It's probably going to happen, more than likely. Unless we can build it very fast. Oh, shit. Stuns are here. Stuns are real. Yeah, Prism, I know. Definitely gonna need to get one of those, for sure. That is definitely gonna be necessary. God, these fucking stuns, though. Seriously. Oh, wow, it does have particle beams. I did not know the Starfire had particle beams. That's cool. Because look at that, it is cleaning up the plasma, I like it. Got its shields on. Doesn't really have any defense at all yet. That's fine. It's gonna take a little while to come online, for sure. Getting its defenses. It's got some lasers, at least. That's at least something. 
Got particle beams, good. I keep thinking it runs out of energy, probably. I think. Since this thing is almost built, let's go ahead and get this prism started. This thing is so freaking big, though. This is gonna take some time, that's for sure. Well, this way we can move the Starfire a little bit forward here. So we can actually be defending. It's got pretty awesome range, for sure. I'm wondering if those guys came and attacked me simply because it was a timed thing? Or was it that I got too far up? I'm not really sure. Oh, look at that. I can put some Omnis here now. Oh, nice. Oops. It's not where I wanted to build it, but it's fine. At least when they get built, they'll start cannoning away at this douche nozzle. Douche. What a bag of douche. Get out of here, dude. Seriously. Tired of your shit. Remember, I can't move my Omnis until this ship dies. Clearing away a little bit more plasma. Make sure that's doing some good here. Okay. Shoot. There's no way I can get that, is there? Nope. No, there's no way. I would have to sneak over here and grab it. Which I probably will do. I did this before and it will help again. Plasma's annoying, but whatever. Get rid of this. This way we can focus more on this ship. How's that prism doing? Oh, it's almost built. Well, the command module is at least almost built, and it's pretty well protected that I think it's actually going to get built this time. You don't want those MK7s being used on particulate. You really don't. It will use up a lot of energy if you do. I think I'm gonna need these guys here anymore, so I think I'm gonna move them over here. But that fucking doppel, man. I'm gonna eat them alive. I'm gonna eat them up. Yep. Ate one of them. Damn it. Kill that doppel, please. And then if you could, could you possibly make it over here now? Maybe he's too busy with his missiles? He is too busy with his missiles. Sweet. That's awesome. And here's the prism. Shit. Ah, oh, I got stunned. Damn it. That's fine. Not the end of the world. Sadly, this thing... Oh, wait, no, this doesn't have fighters, does it? It's a Dreadnought is arguably the most powerful ship in the Crystallid fleet, supporting massive cannons and weapons devastating enough to tear through particulate formations with ease. Yeah, that's right. But again, I'm not using it for particulate. I'm using it to rid myself of these damn humans. Being such assholes. Please, could you kindly just die? Kindly die, please. I'm trying to get my headquarters in there so I can start lathing that. Because I don't have a shard. Okay, he finally died, thank goodness. So I can start lathing this way. Now I have to be careful because the prism isn't even built yet. 
Yeah, it technically is not built yet, that's for sure. Go, 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 fast, fast, fast. Go, 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 go. Good. Now, can you mire that? That's the question. Can you mire that by yourself? You might be able to. Uh, nope, not quite. It was close, though. Very close. Do I even dare think that I can get more in there, though? Man, this thing has a lot of energy. A prism. It's got a ton of energy. I'm gonna try and see if I can get more in here. It might work. There's not a whole lot of particulate there right now. Down, down, down. Down, 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 down. Oh, jeez, that second one took some damage, though. Fucking dobbles. Fucking stupid shitty-ass dobbles. They're such fucking assholes. They really are assholes. So I'm going to move you up here and see if we can take out this ship. That would be nice. Oh, those MK7s, man. Those MK7s. Oh my god. They are just a thing of beauty. Let's see if we can take this thing out. I don't know why I'm doing this with the headquarters. This is really not a good idea, but that's what I'm doing. would not recommend this. should really build those shards, but instead I'm going to build an amethyst, and I think I'm going to build the diamond as well, just in case. Even though the diamond is not particularly a very strong ship. Yeah, that's right, energy mine. Grab that first. Okay, so I could build Omnis here, but I can't because it's mired ground right now, which is unfortunate. I can only build one Omni here, though. Maybe I could build some Omnis in space? Maybe they'll be relatively safe? God, is there nowhere else to land? Wow, there's nowhere to land for three Omnis. Oh crap. Yes, there is. Right over here. Dude. Land it. Because we need all the miring help we can get. Maybe that's enough miring? I hope so. Looks pretty good. Can I get that thing? Oh yeah, you can't get it from here. That's right. Bring up the amethyst, bring up the diamond. Really need those mine dischargers as well. An unfortunate victim of a collision with an asteroid that shattered is still a valuable combatant. Its enhanced firepower will be useful. Whoa. Well, that's interesting. Oh my god, it's huge as well. Should have known it would be huge. We'll build that too. Oh, I can't get the lathe in there. Damn it. Is there a place here that might work? Let's see if this will work. I know he's going to die, but I want to see if he's going to start. Yeah, he is going to start. Okay. He's definitely super dead, though. But that's okay, because I can build lots of Omnis here. I think this is going to be the easiest way to try and take this emitter. Come on, Omni. You can do it. Oh, I think he's still getting hurt. 
No? Is he alive? The other Omnis are helping him with their cannons. Oh, he's still alive? He's gonna take it? He's gonna take the emitter. Amazing. And we have a very good fleet now, so once those bastards decide to come and destroy us, well, they're gonna have another thing coming, hopefully. Hopefully we'll be able to actually defend ourselves this time. That is the plan. I wish I could get one more of these guys, that would be nice. Are they thinking of coming? No, not yet. I don't think so. There's the C-Class, though. We're just trying to get rid of all this junk here. There we go. That'll make things immensely easier. I can reach that. Yep, I can reach it. Good. Let's just get rid of that. What exactly am I going to do with this... this particulate? I don't know. Not exactly sure. But they've got fighters. Oh, here come their ships. Come the ships! They're coming in! But we've got defenders this time, bitches. You don't even stand a chance this time. I don't want to be too cocky. But it's looking pretty damn good here. Oh yeah! Look at them just get wrecked. Boom! Yes! Oh, I love it. Come on, Shattered. This is an interesting ship, for sure. So are we just going to have to be on the defensive all the time? That's not going to be super great. Oh, look, even your armor didn't even stop you from dying, eh? Well, you didn't quite die, but... You're not looking too good. Oh god, there's the Varro. This could be bad. Oh, he's getting ripped up. He's he's backing off. Hell yeah. Kill that bitch. Yeah! Get those cruisers down. Yeah, this is looking good. Are they just gonna seriously keep coming? Really? Forever? Really? They're never gonna stop? I don't even know how long, or how to kill these guys. Do you just kill them and then they're done? Maybe? Maybe if we can manage to actually kill them, they're just done? That's my hope. Because we're killing a bunch of them, that's for sure. That one's super dead. He's gonna get sniped by the MK7s. Yep, he's dead. Oh, those MK7s. Navarro is really scary. It's running away already. Bitch. Gotta run. I will freaking tear you guys apart. Yeah, I think they might... Wait. Yeah, I think they do only have probably one life. Maybe. Because I don't know where they're getting built from if they don't have one life. Oh, the Shattered is almost ready. The funny thing is, they come right into this, uh, this emitter too, which just absolutely wrecks them. And since this guy has so many, has so much energy, I think he's good to go. I'm hoping these aren't being remade though, let me see. Are they? 
if they are, where? Here? Are these things making shifts? I think they might be. Oh my fucking god, are you kidding me? You killed my fucking prism? Really? How did they manage that shit? I think they just wa they just drove right into it like fucking assholes. Great. Now I don't have as much defending. But there's still the particulate over here. Those are quite nice defenders. Yeah. Tearing them up. The only problem is it's just a constant fucking attack. What am I supposed to do? I'm only on the defensive. And sadly, this Shattered doesn't have an MK7. So without the Prism, I mean, I don't even stand a, ch uh, a ghost of a chance. Get him! Get him! Fuck him up! How is he not dying? Look at this, they just drive right on your stupid ships. And that's how they kill him. I fucking hate this. I hate it so much. How are they not fucking dying? How is this thing alive? It's sitting right on an emitter! How are you even fucking remotely alive? Oh, it's starting to get wrecked now. Ugh, it's about fucking time. Where the hell am I gonna put this guy? So that he can grab this. I don't even think I can put him anywhere. There's literally nowhere for him. Except for where he is now. It's the only spot, and he can't reach it. Fuck. That fucking sucks. Shit, they just don't give me enough time to do anything. Why do they have to build these ships at the speed of light, creator? I'm gonna ask him, because fuck this. Does it ever stop? Ever? And it's not like you can just run over here and take this, because you can't. This will fucking murder you. Yeah, I don't... I don't know what the fuck he was thinking with this. This is fucking impossible. There goes the prism! Isn't it beautiful? Just fucking killed again. Isn't it lovely? And now I have almost no defenses. Nearly no defenses. Because all they do is come in and use their unlimited ships to just ram you. That's totally fair. Fuck it. Fuck it. I'm done. This is the end of the stream, too. I'm just... I'm done with that. I'm just done. It has a low rating for a goddamn reason, because it's a piece of shit. I'm gonna look at the forum, and I'm gonna see just how many people are complaining about this. I was determined to beat this the hard way by killing ships without capturing the top part of the map, but sadly it didn't work out. It was a good challenge, as I don't care about time, I'll need to have another attempt to try it that way. Not sure why this has such a low rating, it's a piece of shit, that's why. I guess some people just can't figure it out or something. Yeah, what are you supposed to do? Cheers, guys. Glad you enjoyed. Yeah, also, though, this was fantastic. There's a spoiler here. The gun on the top left island is amazing. And the blue particle explosion top right was a neat idea. Wait, there's a gun on the top left island? Hold up a second. Is that the whole idea? Because there's no way you can beat that the other way. At least that there's something up here. There's like a gun up here or something. Honestly, I don't see how you're supposed to get it, though. Hold on. I just want to see something. I'm not going to play it. I just want to see something real quick. 
I'm definitely willing to believe that this is impossible to beat. Because after a while, I mean, it takes fucking forever just to claim all of this. It takes forever to claim all of this. What am I supposed to do up here? What gun? This thing? Is this what you're talking about? But if so, I mean, how do you even get this? There's no way to. There's no way to just easily get this. It's impossible. I thought it might be possible to get, like, a an Omni up here, but there's no way an Omni's gonna make it there. It's not gonna happen. I mean, hell, I couldn't even fucking get over here. Where there's also a gun, but apparently there's all this shit protecting it all over. Like, what the fuck? Why did he have to put it on such a goddamn timer like that? It's such a piece of shit. I mean, I understand. I like the, the maps where you actually have a chance, but that was not a chance. I mean, I was killing ships left and right, and they just come back like 10 seconds later. How is that goddamn fair? They don't even give you like one minute to be able to catch your breath. And to be able to plan out what you're gonna do. No, fuck no. It's just ten ships every ten goddamn seconds. I don't see how that's fair. At all. I just don't see it. Like, okay, I secured the bottom right, but after that I'm too slow to be able to do anything else before the horde shows up from the middle left. Even with my entirety of my fleet built and 100% powered, I lose within two minutes of those guys popping up. Since they don't stop coming. I use the default command ship as a 20 second nuke to chunk the big station just to the right of their spawn, but I couldn't take it before they showed. How does anyone beat this? A good question. Once you've claimed the bottom right, you should head for the top right corner immediately. You should attempt to exploit the gaps around the sides of the particle fields to send Omnis in and follow up with the prism. Send all the Omnis past the north station. Just note, you will not be able to take the planet easily without putting that planetary defense cannon into the Overmire state, since it absolutely wrecks everything. That's why you need it to kill Jericho Station, since you cannot do it using your fleet. Trust me, I've tried. Actually, I skipped the top right part by rushing with 10 Omnis to the top left part. I managed to park one Omni around the mine, the rest is history. Oh yeah, I guess that could work. You could try rushing with Omnis. And just hope that somebody survives. Another spoiler. I tried to avoid using anything irreplaceable unless absolutely necessary. So I shifted the fleet around a few times before activating the cannon. Then I ran an Omni rush attempt straight past a wolf. Still a bit new to this game, I thought the big explosion of blue particles was the railgun, so I figured I just missed my opportunity and kept wailing on stuff the slow way. Managed to take out the ship producers on the left. How does this person say they're still a bit new to this game, seriously, and they actually got to the railgun? Are you fucking kidding me? How in the goddamn hell did they do that? It takes so fucking long to build anything! I mean, of course you're not going to build the chips. I mean, they're not going to do shit. Even the amethyst doesn't do anything. The diamond doesn't do anything. The only thing that is your saving grace is the prism. That's it. And once it dies, I mean, you're fucked. That's it. It's just... I don't know. It's just maps like this that I hate. So I probably will not be beating this story mode. In fact... You know, let's not end the stream. Let's not let's not cause this bastard of an asshole to make me end the stream. Now see, if he would have made it to where there's some kind of a timer on it, even just the smallest timer, just the smallest little timer. 
to where I could actually have, like, like I said, maybe a minute to re-energize? Sure. But you know what, dick face? Your levels are done. I'm done. I'm done with the crystallids. No more. Let's go back to playing the top rated levels. Because fuck that shit, man. Fuck it. Fuck it hell. Fuck it to hell. Wait, what is this? Hmm? What is going on here? Oh, it's because it's still in favorites, my bad. Oop. There we go. Yeah, see, where Doppel's Fear to Tread. Now see, this guy made a good level. All three of his stories were beatable. They were tough, they were challenging, but they were beatable. Whereas that other fuck fucktard, his, his was not beatable. Just, other people are saying they beat it, they probably cheated. Okay, because you can use sandbox fleets. There's no way that can be done with the real fleet. It just can't be. Unless you're, like, super fast. But I don't understand how you can be super fast, because you have to build. And building takes fucking forever. So, yeah. Anyway. We got where Doppel's Fear to Trend. We've done this one. It was a lot of fun. The whole entire story was really great. Um, this box map looks interesting. I haven't played this one. This would be the next highest rated map. It looks terrifying. But let's give it a shot. I mean, it has a good rating. Maybe it's not terrible. Custom module map 35. The virus module. Made by something... Ayatizu. Edit struck. Tacon defense range by Stokeman. Edit struck. I don't understand the edit struck. I don't get that. I guess if you knew how to use it, it would be incredibly useful. But I, I don't see the use in it. Especially when, if you don't have an auto struck builder. Like, there's no reason for it. Oh my god, look at that doppel. Jesus, that is a big old giant doppel. Well. Well, this looks shitty, doesn't it? Alright, well, we got a farm down here with six gems. That's something. And I have my own struck here. Interesting. We have an emitter. Okay. What do these emitters look like? Let me see here real quick. Well, we've got the fox things. We've got the fox fires. Or fireflies. we got the bugs. we got the fox lathe. we got the electric one. we got the mini grabbers. Okay. we got three mini grabbers. we got the mix. Nifty little ship. And then the relay. These are our only real defenders besides the bugs and the fireflies. Hmm. Alright. We've got some ships up here. What the hell are these? What in the world are these things? What the hell? Man. Some of these maps never cease to amaze me, I'll tell you. Let's see what we're looking at here. How are these emitters looking? This one hasn't even started. Neither is that one. What? Okay, now they're starting. Yeah, they're pretty decent. Pretty decent emitters. Gonna be a little bit tricky for sure. I think. What is this thing? Oh! Those Omnis? Why are they surrounded in blue? Huh. Weird. And is this... Oh, it's building struck. Okay. I see. Hmm. So I wonder if I have auto struck as well. So if I edit it and link it up, can I protect these things? Is that what the whole edit struck is for? Could be. I don't know about armor. Oops. Doesn't really matter as long as it just links up. 
kind of like that, so maybe my struck will battle their struck. Is there, well, there's struck up here too. Does it really want me to paint the whole entire thing? I'd rather not. Well, for now, let's just see if that actually works. If it does, that would be awesome. If it doesn't, that would be slightly less awesome. Problem is, there's like nowhere to put Omnis. Because there's no land here. Alright, let's build the bugs because they're relatively easy to build. At least we've got the fox lathe, which has a double lathe on it. Uh, we'll go ahead and get the move build speed and I think the energy range increase. I think that's what we'll start out with. I really want to go down south here to try and get that gem farm as early as possible. I feel like that's going to be pretty useful. With these energy pods. We also have another gem here. Fox does like to hide a gem there. This doesn't look like it's going to be too tricky. Does Fox's lathe have a... No, it doesn't have a shield. What? It has cannons on it? Interesting. Interesting indeed. Okay, so let's see here. Mine production. Could go do Omni Reactor. Seems like it would be pretty smart. Yeah, let's go with the Omni Reactors. That way, if I do build Omnis... Hmm... Cannons. There's no way Omnis are going to be able to go over here and win, though. That's just not going to happen. But you can see that my struck is being built. So it is auto-strucking. I wonder if my struck will try and fight their struck. Hmm. That is a good question. It might happen. It might not. I don't know. Anyway, I think I might be able to sneak out here with a lathe. I think I'm gonna build my Firefoxes, or Fireflies, though. Do I have enough room to build this? Just barely. Try and Tetris it in the base. Do we have stunners? I know Fox usually doesn't do stunners, or as far as I've seen. Oh my god, there's a stunner, I see it. Is that the only stunner? How many stuns? Only three! Oh, thank you, Fox. I appreciate that. If you're gonna give stuns, just don't have too many stuns. And then, of course, we've got the Fox Elect, which is a pretty nice ship. I can build it inside this truck, it's fine. Wait, is the energy range not working? Oh, no, it's working. Oh, it's just not helping very much, jeez. Oh, wow, look, my struck is fighting their struck. That is kind of cool. I kind of like it. Oh my god, there's so many flippy mitters too! Oh, I love it. Man, I love Fox's maps. Seriously, they're so good. They are a bit tricky though, so you can't just come in and be like, Oh yeah, I'll be able to beat this easily. No, you gotta think. You gotta use your brain. This... Uh, emitter doesn't look particularly strong, which is good. I think this is the lathe? Yeah, that's the lathe. I'm just trying to get the electric one up so that we can have a little bit of discharge protection. It's the only one with discharge. So, yeah. It's a little bit dangerous. Oh my god, these things have reactors? What? All those mini grabbers have reactors? That is fantastic. Oh, you know what I'm noticing, though? We have a relay, but we don't have a tanker. Hmm. Interesting. I'm just waiting for my ships to be built real quick. And then we'll probably press out. Uh, we could use the relay for sure. Let's go ahead and build that, too. I think I might be building a bit too much. But as you can see, I mean, there's ships and there's dopples in here, but as far as I can tell right now, they seem to be just patrolling. Which is honestly the way you should build a level. If you're gonna build a level with ships and dopples and stuff, just make them patrol. 
you know? Or don't make them bombard the player every, every, all the time. Like, as soon as they get there, you're fucked. That's it. You're done. If you haven't beaten the level by then, or you haven't made significant progress or something, you're fucked. Because they just keep coming back. They, like, instantaneously build themselves. I don't even know how they do it. That's cheating. Because I can't do that, that's what I would call cheating. Hmm. I gotta wait for at least the relay. Because I'm thinking of putting the relay, like, right here. That should give us enough energy room. That'll take us all the way up to here for energy, which should be perfect. Which means the bugs can push in a bit. And the fireflies can be right behind them. They shouldn't take too much damage. Not too much. And then we get that beautiful double lathe in there. Oh, it's going to work on the emitter. Good. I was wondering if it was going to go double on the emitter, or if it was going to do the emitter and the mine at the same time. I'm very glad that I chose to do double emitter. Then you kill the mine. Then you build it, and boom! Energy for all. Alright. So now... Oh boy. This is going to be the tough part. Why is my struck not going any further? It, oh, it's slowly moving. Okay. So, now, let me see... Can I possibly reach that? Yes, I can! Sweet! This should be relatively safe. I'm just gonna try and get some of these mirrors out. Now, since his stunner is over here... That leads me to believe that it's going to be coming from this direction only. Which means, if I put this guy, like, right here, he should be pretty safe. He should keep us pretty safe. See if I can get that auto-strucker. Yep, I can kill it. Oh, careful. Careful. Oh, stuns? Really? But the, but the discharger. That's fine. It's not that big of a deal right now. I'm just trying to get this... Oh my god! Energy mine! Are you ever coming back? There we go, finally. Give him energy, and then... Come on, come on. Just break it, just break it. Just break it. Good. Back up. Let's bring some... Bring the relay over here. Should... No, that doesn't give us quite what I'm looking for. Maybe here? That's about perfect. Because now we're going to try and push a little bit further. I heard more stunners. They're coming. Oh, shit. There are ships here. Gotta be careful. Need to put this a little bit higher, I think. Where are those stunners? They're coming. Why is there only two? I thought there was three. Oh, there's one on top of another. Okay, that's fine. They're coming for us. Damn. Well, that's not the end of the world, I don't think. Careful. Go. Go for it. Go, 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 go. If I can just kill the emitter, I'll back off. Oh crap. Can I do it? Maybe? I'm only gonna have one lathe. Can it be done? Can it be done? Come on! Still got its command module very armored. Perfect. Back off. Okay, so that ship is gonna be a bit of a problem. So, let's get these mixers in here. These are some pretty gorgeous ships, I gotta say. Do they have any... Any descriptions with any of these? Oh, there's one. 
a small discharger ship. That's it. Dual lathe ship. I like it. I like the short and sweet descriptions. It's very nice. Very nice, very crisp, very clean. Alright, can you get in here and get this now? If you can, we will move in and protect it. Dude. Oh, we got... We got incoming. We got stunners incoming. Go get him, get him, get him. Nice. Very nice. Get it. Get it, get it, get it. Don't get it. He's out of energy. Shit, are you kidding me? That's fine. You did good enough, dude. Don't worry. No, it's because we're building. Oh, these ships, man. I don't know. I don't like it. They're not dying. These bugs aren't going to be able to hold out forever. Although once these are built, they can come and help. If they'll ever finish building. Jeez. Oh god, that's not good. Yeah, that's really bad. Back off. We're going to back off just a bit. <clears throat> Maybe if we can just um, get some of this dealt with. Where's my bug? There you are. Come over here. Anybody that has cannons, I'm going to put them over here and see if they can maybe mire this away. And then we'll build a crap load of Omnis and see if we can land them in there, maybe? I'm gonna build the crap load of Omnis right now. Oh, that's it? Seven Omnis? Damn, that's not very much. Crap. Uh, energy is definitely being a problem. But, those gems, oh, they're right there. This looks like another mixer. This looks like another lady, though. That's awesome. And this one right here is another grabber, which, eh, it's something, but it's less awesome, for sure. I did get the Omni Reactors, right? Yes. I did not get Omni Cannons, sadly, but I do have Omni Reactors, so shift O. And then I'm going to give them a couple of waypoints here. Just so that I make sure that they don't touch Struck. Over here. Then I'll just have you land all around this 16. Okay. We'll see what happens. I don't know though. The ships are a little bit dangerous. Maybe we can do it though. They'll kill the 16 for sure. Yeah, he's super dead. And then they'll start to work on the other ones and maybe get something? Maybe Meyer? Ooh, 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 that's not, that's not pretty. That's not pretty at all. You're doing all right. I'm still getting this one, which will help. Now, can they mire enough, or will I need to build more? I'm going to build more, of course. Good. Good, the dischargers are there. I'm going to bring these guys up to the front. I feel like they're good frontline ships. These are good for dealing with ships, too. They've got, what, three missiles, three cannons? That's pretty decent. Oh, these freaking Omnis, they're doing it all by themselves. You troopers. You are some real troopers, I'll tell you that. But don't worry, I'm going to get you help. Don't you worry, they're coming. They're just a little bit slow because the FPS is a little bit laggy. But if we can take that gem farm, oh my god. The world is our oyster. Think about it. Six gems. 
I could get the mind dischargers. Uh, defensive struck might not be a bad idea. Mind production increase, that's three right there. That would probably be it for them for the for right now at least. Interesting. This thing is weird. Don't know how to feel about that. You could flip some emitters, but it would take something. I need Omni Cannons too. Because I want my Omnis to be helping us be protected. How is this thing not built? I don't understand how it's not built. I'm not complaining, but I don't understand how it's not built. But just you wait until I get my Omnis going. Oh wait, that's different. That's Fox Cannon. Well, that's another Elect. That's not a lathe. This cannon could be useful. Hell yeah. There's another Omni. That's pretty fantastic. Uh, let's see if I can go ahead and put an Omni over here. Oh shoot, that's right though. We can't get the gems without energy. Fudge. And I don't know if a relay can do it. It might be able to. There we go. I mean, it's not like it's really that difficult. Oh, I don't know. Well, maybe it is. I think this is definitely a grabber, though. Oh, careful, careful! You're gonna get cannoned! Oh, you're gonna get cannoned! Ouch. Yeah, because when you're up in the air like that, you can get hurt. See if we can move these guys in a little bit closer. Maybe they can help out a bit more. Oh, shit. But at least the uh, Omnis should keep it pretty well. Look at that. Yeah. Attack. Kill. Really? Yeah, it's another grabber. Interesting. Can you please kill that ship, please? Really wish I had Omni Cannons right now, but you know, what we'll do is we'll just spend a little bit of time, you know, grinding here. Just a little bit. Doesn't have to be too much time. Damn, I thought that was a second lathe. I was so excited. Turns out it was not a second lathe. That's so sad. really need that defensive struck too, but I feel like Omni Cannons are definitely the first thing I probably want to get. Careful. Oh, things are getting stunned. I don't like it. I don't know why it's happening. It shouldn't be happening. Oh, if I could just flip that emitter. God, that would be amazing. But I don't know if I can. I could definitely give it a shot, though. Uh, I don't know. I don't like that ship. That ship could eat my lathe for breakfast, I think. Let me try and put these guys here in the front. They make great walls, you know? And they do a good job of dispatching ships. Bugs over here. Fireflies over here. Discharger right there. I do have the other discharger, but I don't really know if I need it right now. I'm trying to get this damn farm going. If I can just get one gem, I can get the Omni Cannons, and that would make a huge difference. Either that, or is there anything else I could think of that would be better? I don't think so. I think Omni Cannons are going to be the best for me right now. Alright, Relay, are you ready? Try and go in this little nook there. That could be interesting. And we'll try and double lathe this flippy meter here. Hope for the best. As long as it can hold out. Oh, hold out, lathe. Hold out. All you gotta hold, do is hold out until we flip it. And that ship is coming. Got it. Get out of there now. Go. Relay, you're out of there too. 
Yes! How do you like that, you bastards? Yeah, how do you like that? Yeah, look at that. Your ship is all destroyed now, isn't it? No, I think I will go for those Omni Cannons. I think that's gonna be the best. That's gonna help my defense out a lot. I actually have a couple more Omnis I can build too, so... Why not build them? Why not indeed? Get these ships wrecked, hopefully. That's quite nice. Alrighty, so let me think if I go back here with my relay, just kind of set it in this little nook here. Well, that, that ship is having a very hard time. <laughs> He's having an incredibly hard time. Don't even think about destroying my relay. Don't you even think about it. I saw you coming over here thinking about it. How dare you. Oh, I'm loving this already. Let's see if we can sneak in here and maybe kill this energy mine. That would be nice. That would be super beneficial. And there's another flippy emitter over there. That is absolutely crazy. There's a ship here that is kind of dangerous. I don't like it. But I can laser it to death! Laser, laser, laser! Laser and cannons, laser and cannons! Oh, jeez, that is dangerous. I kind of want to push this in as deep as I can so that it can hopefully get these ship creators too. Nice, there's another gem. What do I do with this gem, though? think defensive struck for sure definitely going for the defensive struck i want the mines to be more protected and not to mention the mines have a lathe now oh, no 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 yeah these these ship builders are dead thank you very much you may not like it but that's the way it's gonna be Oh, don't eat my ship? Seriously? You jackasses. I hate it when they do that. That was one of my more, more expensive ones, too. I hate it. Oh, this... This, uh... Yeah, this emitter is not very busy, is it? It's not doing much. Hopefully it'll do more for me than it does for them. Boop. Got it. No, it's really not doing much, is it? Not at all. Kind of sad, but hey, every little bit helps, right? Kill these. Oh yeah, that's my ship being built. I was like, what the hell's going on there? Oh god. Stuns are real. The stuns are so very real. I think one thing that I might need to do is that I might need... No, maybe not. Looks like it's doing alright. It's killing that ship. I don't know how it is, but hey. It is dead. That's cool. Hmm. Oh my god, look. My struck has won. My struck is like totally won over here. That's interesting. What if the... HQ could just come out here and try this real quick. Try and get away from the cannon, or the energy mine, if at all possible. This thing's not very powerful either. Maybe it can handle it. It has reactors, so it can build- it can rebuild it itself. Yeah, look at that, it's doing it. Holy crap, that's awesome. And these emitters are like super weak. Although the ships, the ships are a little bit dangerous. They could be a bit of a problem. But that's the emitter right there. Here's the energy mine. Can I get it? And then just start building it? 
building up the struck. Oh yeah. And then I think I'll use this mine to build another one of these elect ones. Elect is what I believe it's called. Oh crap. Actually, I'll just get the mine dischargers. Not gonna help very much now, that's for sure, but whatever. Should be fine. I lost my mine over here? Freaking kidding me? Really? I'm not gonna be going for that, no way. I need my energy. It might be smart to build a grabber. I can probably leave that alone now. I think it can probably handle itself. It'll build the struck from the inside to the outside, at least. That's the one thing I love about the defensive struck, is that the mine itself gets a lathe, so it can build its own struck. Very nice. Thank god this fox lathe has some armor on it. It is one hell of a lathe, I'll tell you that. Okay, pull back. Alright, what are these Omnis going to do? Uh, maybe go over there. Maybe that's not a bad idea. I'll take about five of them. Ooh, shit. Gotta be careful. Maybe I'll have to set up a couple waypoints here. That's my struck, so I don't have to worry about it. Oh, HQ's getting wrecked. Kill this auto strucker. Actually, I can just pull myself in nice and tight and I can kill this too. I might actually even be able to kill this one as well. Maybe. Once this one's dead, I can get up, up there a little bit closer. Good. Things are looking pretty alright here. Wait, this is a fox grabber. That's different than these T-mini grabbers. I mean, they seem about the same. This one takes 11 seconds to build the command module, and this one takes 11 seconds as well. The whole size is the same. It's the same thing. I don't know why, why one is called a mini and one is not. Oh god, I'm losing Omnis. Fuck. No, I'm losing Omnis. Why am I losing Omnis? I do not want to lose Omnis. I need to keep these Omnis. What is this? What is this thing? They look like little Omni icons. A very, very little Omni icon. See, they're Omnis. But why? And why are they so tiny? Do they want me to put Omnis in that location or something? Or an Omni, like in the middle of it or something? That could be. It could make it like a Super Omni or something. Oh, that would be awesome. That would be super cool. Mine cannons, rock burner, benign emergent. Uh, might go for the benign emergent. I think I'm gonna go for the emitter control though, so that we can start actually having these emitters do something useful. I'll send this one that way. I'll send this one this way, because I'm headed that way next. This one sucks, but I'll send it up here too. They blow. Most of the emitters suck. Alright, hopefully that will keep them busy. I'm gonna come over here and see if I can shut down this emitter too. The good thing is, see, the emitters are kind of strong, but the thing is they're spreading their particulate all over the place, so the maximum amount of particulate is kind of already alive. So they can't really react that well. This one looks pretty strong though. But I appreciate that Fox made a map that's not too difficult. It feels pretty good. Come on. Got it. Good. Alright, let's build some Omnis here.
We've got some interesting new ships. Well, the cannon's not new, but we've got some interesting new ships coming up here. I don't know what they are. What happens if I put an Omni... What? Now it's rotating? The fuck? I'm gonna... I can't put an Omni there. What is this thing? I wish I knew what this thing was. I can't get it. What is this? I don't know what the hell this thing is. Oh, that thing died. Good. Yeah, I don't know what the hell that thing is. I guess it's nothing. As far as I can tell, it seems to be nothing. Do I want anything else? Um... Nah, I think I should be good now. I might need Rock Burner, maybe. But for right now, we should be fine. There's this guy over here. Grab that ship. And you're gonna come down here and grab this ship. They've got reactors and cannon. Look! What? What in the hell is that? Is it making Omnis? What? Oh, that's awesome! That's what it is, it's an Omni generator! I have never seen the likes. What's this? A port? When loaded, the module shoots a virus straight towards straight forwards and tries to attach to an enemy ship. If the virus can attach, it cuts through the ship and starts to suck energy from the ship to create new viruses. The amount of virus spawns depends on the amount of energy stolen. What? What in the hell? That sounds amazing! Hell yeah! And then we've got the port, which is kind of like a tanker, sort of. It can kind of defend itself, though. I like it. Uh, I don't think there's any way we can get this with the Omnis, at least. Get out of here. The thing I like about the ships is they can go above the Omnis and they won't kill the Omnis. So, how do I get more Omnis here? Do I need like a port to be able to feed it energy or something? I can try. It worked once though. Maybe it just works over time? Oh yeah, there it is. Oh, I guess it just takes a while, but then you just get unlimited Omnis. That is freaking fantastic. I like it. I like it a lot. Okay, so that really got going. That's good. Oh, Jesus, those are some gigantic, enormous doppels. I, I don't know how I feel about that. How am I supposed to kill these damn doppels? Are these the bugs? Yeah. I don't know how to kill this double. Oh, balls. This is gonna be tough. This is gonna be tough. If we can get over here, we can kill the stunner. That'd be nice, but these big old blobby doppels, I don't like them. I don't like them at all. Big old blobby doppels got me afraid. Oh, headquarters. Oh shit, where did I leave my headquarters? I can't even remember. Probably nowhere good. Probably left them in a really terrible spot. Oh my god, this doppel is literally not dying. Um... Well, shit. What am I supposed to do? How do I kill it? Maybe just chip away at it, I guess? Wait a minute, wait a minute. I think I know. Send the blue particulate directly at the doppel. 
Go for it. Go for it, my lovelies. Uh, yeah, that's an MK7. I was like, was that an MK7 gun I saw? Yeah, that was an MK7. A little terrifying. Does this have a builder? I have a feeling it probably does. Hmm. Let's see if I can run in here and maybe double lay this real quick. Oh, I might need a relay. Get over there, Relay. Hurry. There you go. I think all the Relay does is it literally just bounces energy. Whereas the port, I think it stores energy? Oh, it has its own reactors, too. That's kind of nifty. You know what? I'm going to take this over here with me. Oh, the farm's depleted, so we only have the two gems. Unless there's more, but I don't know. Okay, this thing is getting wrecked now, which is good. I wonder if I could possibly get this thing built. This energy mine? Yeah, there we go. It's pretty nice. And the Doppel's not even attacking it, which I like. This way we can move a little bit more forward. make this doppel wish he'd never been born. If they're even born. Oh yeah, he is wrecked. Wait, he doesn't have a spawner. What the hell? That's weird. I would have thought he would have a spawner. Not that I'm complaining, I just was expecting it. Very interesting. Where's my discharger? Oh, he's way back here. Well, that's not helping. Get up here. There you go. Now, where did I put my headquarters? Oh yeah, you're over here. You should probably go back in here. Go back to the safety. There's the virus, sir! I forgot about this thing. Yeah, hell yeah. So I think it just literally shoots out viruses? I wonder if it works on doppels. Let's find out. find out if you work on doubles, shall we? Fire! Oh, there it goes. There's the virus. It hit the doppel. I don't think that's what it was supposed to do. But it probably doesn't work on doppels, sadly. Damn it. Yeah, it just explodes. I think it's supposed to infect a ship, though. Seems kind of cool. Can I, like, maybe sneak in here and kill this little thing so it stops building struck so much? Can I get in a little bit tighter? There we go. I wanted to double lay that. Oh, God! What the hell is this thing? I don't like it. I don't like it, though! No. Don't kill my lathe. It never did anything to anybody. Except for killing stuff. No. No, 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 no. MK7 guns. Not fun. I'm leaving. <laughs> I will leave, thank you very much. You know what? I'm gonna put this virus right there. That way when their ships come in, they're gonna get freaking wrecked. Oh man, wait, it's gonna hit the- Oh, it doesn't go forever, okay. I guess that makes sense. Is it smart? It's smart! Look at that! It's smart, it doesn't just go straight forward. It tries to target ships. Oh god, it's dangerous. Come on, get it. Oh, we got him! We got him, he's first! Hell yeah! Oh my god, it's amazing! Oh my god, it's just chain reactioning everywhere! Oh, I love it. That is amazing! That is probably one of the most exciting things I've ever seen in this game. That was unbelievable, and I could still do it, too! 
Well, now I kind of want your ships to keep spawning. <laughs> Give something for my virus to do. And even if it misses, it does, like, a little burst of blue uh, particulate, which is something. You guys, this is all depleted, so how about you come up here? And then go in here. Need to make sure you're very, very safe about this. Is it only four? Oh, I don't feel like that's going to be enough. I may have to create some in space here, but we'll see. Man, where's my discharger? God, you're always so far away. Get in here so you can be useful. Eek. Oh, those MK7s are really scary. Oh god, Doppels. Freaking Doppels, man. Alright. Launch it that way. Port, you're going to come over here. Virus, I think I want you over here. Ow. Took a little bit of damage, but that's fine. We're gonna try and get some new... Wait, did they all die? Oh, they did. Damn it. I had a feeling that might happen. Okay, that's looking pretty good. Oh god, the virus. Oh, no, 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 no. Back up just a little bit. Alright, that's it. You didn't like my, what, four Omnis I sent? Oh, how are you going to feel about this many Omnis? However many this is. It's a lot of Omnis. A shitload of Omnis. It actually might be too much. I don't even know if I can get them in here. You got to give them the waypoints, though. Yeah, it should be fine. Give them the waypoints so that they all stay in one C. They all make sure that they go perfectly in a line. Missing the struck entirely. Oh, there's missiles! Missiles! Shit. Just just kill whatever you want to kill. I don't even care what you kill. Just just do it. And then start miring. Jeez. Okay, I lost some, but it, that's not the end of the world for sure. I did well. Oh! That's just what I needed. That is just what the doctor ordered, the Fox MK7. Is it the last ship? There are several Omnis here. There are some ships up here too. Alright. I can definitely see how this got like a high rating. This is such a great level. I'm having a blast so far. I need to sneak in here and get this one. That emitter is kind of pissing me off. Okay, MK7. Doppels and ships only. Got a lot of freaking armor, too. Look at that armor. Doesn't have its MK7 gun yet, so I gotta be careful. Shit. Damn it. The cool thing is you can kind of shoot the MK7 projectiles sometimes, which is kind of cool. But that also means I can have mine shot too, which is kind of uncool. Man, there's so many of these things. The cannons and the mixers. I don't like them, though. They are pretty damn cool. See if I can go ahead and take this over. I'd like to take this energy mine, please. Beautiful. Very nice. I'm going to bring the MK7 over here so they can hopefully help with this doppel. And what I could do is aim directly at that doppel with that. That should help. Hopefully we can keep this energy mine alive. That would be really nice. I think I'm going to amp this 
And I'm going to amp this and see what it does. Oh, it's going to... Oh, got him. Got him with the virus. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> that is so freaking amazing. That is never going to cease to be amazing. Is this thing ever going to build its MK7? There we go, finally. It took forever. I love the fact that Fox's port has cannons and missiles, too. That's very interesting. Ooh, this is going to be a tricky one. It's got such nasty land. You can't land an Omni there at all. But you're dead, dude. You are not getting away. Dead. See, these, these uh, doppels only seem to have one life. And after that, they seem to die. Which is quite useful. Okay, so Omnis, I have a new mission for you. I want you to come like that. You guys can come over here. Ooh, careful, don't get the hit. Don't get hit by the MK7 shots. See, now the Omnis will use their cannons to help out a bit with the defense. Like it. Can I get an Omni down here at all? Yeah, I could get one right there. Oh shoot, why am I trying to build them here? I can't build Omnis there. Unless I bring a port. Try and bring the port. Go port. Oh shit. That's not good. Oh man, even the port's not working, never mind. They just refuse to build. Destroy. 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 Because I need to build them down here where they can actually be built. Oops, I need one more. And then you can move them later. Come on. Shoot the virus! Damn it. The virus is gone. Come on, NK7. Get up there and destroy the ships. Yeah, that's right. Now that's a frontline defender. Boom! She's be dead. Look at the Omnis just taking this doppel out. Crazy. Never would have thought I'd see it. Oh shit, this Omni's not even landed. Damn. Probably just sitting there taking damage. Not very smart. Oh no! Ow, got hit by the MK7. That's not fun. And missiles. He did land in time though. Good. Very good. He's gonna get virused! No, he pushed it away. Oh, how sad. Oh, that ship is so dead. Beyond dead. Yep. Good stuff. There's an emitter over here. I wonder if I should just go in there and try and sneak it. I think I could. I'm very careful. I have to be very, very careful. Damn it. Well, that's not being super careful, is it? Not at all. Super dangerous. Damn it. Again, they fucked up my virus. Back away. Back away a bit. We need to get rid of this guy, too, for sure. He just keeps circling around like he owns the place. I do not appreciate it. What the fuck was that? Oh, I think that might have been a virus? Maybe? Not sure. Okay, so this is gonna be a little bit tricky. 
Hmm. Yeah, this is gonna be pretty tricky. So I'm trying to figure out where all these ships are being built from. Is it just literally one, two, three, four? And does that mean that some of these ships, once dead, are just going to be dead forever? Maybe? That could be cool. See if we can get the stopple killed, that would be nice. But I don't think he's gonna come back. Oh, he's just gonna keep healing from that emitter, isn't he? I think so. Let me go ahead and get rid of this emitter if I can. I think I should be able to. It should be relatively not too difficult to get rid of. And he'll stop feeding that land. Although, there is another one over here, which could be potentially a problem as well. Out of there, the doppel's coming, he's gonna eat you alive. Kill that doppel now, guys. You can do it, come on. Yes! Dead as shit. Uh, did I lose something? Oh, I lost a firefly, damn it. I suppose in the big scheme of things, that's not so bad. I'll just lose a firefly. Not the worst thing. That could ever happen. Alright, I think I'm gonna take the virus over here and try and spread it up into the upper right and see if maybe something can happen there. Kinda like right here. This could work. There's the virus. We got him! Got him! Boom! Virus. And... Boom! Nice! Oh my god, this virus is amazing! Boom! Oh, 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 oh. oh, I love it so much. That's the end of the virus, though. Now I'm trying to figure out, are they gonna rebuild those ships? Or are those ships good and dead? Because if they are dead... And that is kind of awesome. You're gonna get virused! Oh, you got virused! Virus boot! Ooh! Nice. Now, unfortunately, they can shoot the virus projectiles, too. It does look like... Well, it does look like maybe they're building another ship here. Interesting. Maybe it does build all the ships. I don't know. Okay, that's not really helping too much anymore. Let's try sending it up kind of this direction, maybe? Yeah, that should work. Like, directly at that mine. I don't know if it'll go that far. It probably won't. But you never know. Oh god. Wrecking the headquarters, that's not great. Shit. It's freaking MK7s, man. I hate them. There's the mine, it's down. that lathe in there. This one doesn't have an MK7 at least. He's gonna get virused. He's coming right in front of the virus. Launch it. Damn, he launched it too late. That's fine though. We're gonna take this emitter. That ought to help a little bit. There's that other emitter over there too. I do have my lathe right here, don't I? Yeah, let's just bring him on down here. I'll send in the double lathe.
Where's that fort? There you are. You're gonna have to come over here too. I'm gonna need a little bit of an ex. Uh, I almost said an exchange of energy, but no. I'm gonna need a little bit of an, of an extended extension to my energy, I should say. Come on up here. Oh shit. At MK7, not super fun. Get in there and see if we can wreck this shit. Maybe. Come on. Crap. Hort! Why are you not giving me energy, you dumb piece of shit? Come on a second. Isn't this supposed to give energy? Or is it only outside of energy sources? Like, do I have to... No, because it has to get energy itself. Aren't you supposed to give me energy, you dumb piece of shit? There, now you've given me energy. What the hell? Or maybe it was trying. Maybe I was just getting wrecked way too quickly. Kind of like that. Oh. Or maybe I was outside of the range. Let's see if I can get the headquarters in there just to finish it off. That would be nice. It's almost dead. It's almost dead, come on. Got it. Get out of there. Get out of there. The virus! It's coming! Oh! Beautiful. I wasn't worried about the virus, of course. It's not gonna hurt me, but it's just super cool. Take these ships with me. We are gonna have some fun attacking these guys. We're gonna have a good time. We're gonna push them pretty hard here, I think. Let's see if we can get this energy mine real quick. Got it. That means we can push up a bit. Shit. You're just eating my ships. I hate that. I hate the way they do that. They just go and they just run into your ships. Because nothing can stop them from doing that. See? Look at that. They just fucking ate my virus ship. Of course. Fucking piece of shit. Well, you know what I need to do is I need to grab this. For sure. Fucking MK7s, man. God fucking damn it! Stupid fucking shithead MK7s. Alright, that's it. That's it. My MK7s coming in now. He's a bit slow. But he's most definitely coming in. I'm tired of this shit. I'm tired of the shit that they're giving me with their ships. It's time for them to die. Yeah, see, I brought my own sniper now, bitches. Where's my virus? There it is. You can come over here. Build another lathe. A couple more of these. Build the mixer. Or mix. Whatever it's called. Kill that thing! Kill it! See, when they have shields, they just drive right into you like fucking assholes. There goes my virus ship. Again, just driving right into me like a fucking asshole. I hate the fact that this guy is so fragile when it comes to his MK7. Like, it's basically just dead. It gets touched, and its MK7 is just dead. Pretty much.
Oh, the MK7s must be these guys. Alright, well, that's a problem. Okay, that'll work. As long as he doesn't get killed by an MK7. Once he gets his virus, maybe it'll reach that far? I don't know, though. They're trying to kill my Particulate as well. Oh, would you please don't fucking do it, you piece of shit. Please kill it. Before it kills something, thank you. Jesus. What a dumb piece of shit. Okay, maybe this will work, hopefully. Dodge. Is it gonna work? Nope. Nope, it doesn't work. Fuck. It's just too good at defending. It's too good at shooting the virus down, sadly. Yes, shoot him! Shoot him with that MK7. Yes! One of them died! Hooray! Launch no, I wanted you to launch this direction. Damn it. Go! Yep. Launched it. Go, go, go! Yes! He's virused! Fuck you, bastard! Yes! I don't think those will be rebuilt. Sweet. So I can go grab this. There's no MK7s. Grab it, grab it, grab it. Quick, 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 quick. Quick, that'll make a huge difference. Don't you even think about it. You son of a bitch. But at least you took something that I don't really care about too much. Oh shit, there's another flippy emitter up there. I didn't see that. Uh, port? Coming up here. And I'll try and double lay that flippy emitter. That port can keep me fed. I think I got this. Nice. Perfect. Alright. You go that way. I'll take this energy mine. Perfect. Finally. And those MK7s were bitch. And I just hate the stupid suicide ships. You give any AI a shield and it just suicides. Oh shit, I'm losing ships over here, aren't I? Yes, I am. That's fine. Definitely not the end of the world when we're actually making progress over here, at least. I'll take you and bring you over here. Get this emitter. I would like to double lay the emitter. Could you double lay it? Thank you. I was like, could you double lay the emitter, maybe? That would be nice. Nice. Okay, good things are happening here. Let's go ahead and aim that there, aim that there. And this one, we'll go back to aiming here again, because we'll definitely have to do this too, because you have to destroy everything to win, so, yeah. Yeah, I'm definitely losing ships on the other side, but that's fine. Definitely not the end of the world, as I've said before. cannons in there. Help it unmire. Oh shit, I didn't see that cannon there. That's a little bit risky. Wee bit dangerous. 
Maybe I should back up just a smidge. I don't really want that cannon shooting me. It's gonna hit me every now and then because it's trying to hit my particles. Which is completely fine with me. Okay, do I have any Omnis anywhere else besides over here? Because I kind of need these defending. I don't know if this is going to be enough Omnis. We'll hope for the best. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to try and take this one step at a time. And that means coming over here. Killing this poor. See, just one step at a time. See if we can kill the zero, maybe. Did I just lose the ship? What did I lose? I don't know what I lost. I don't think I lost a ship. I could do the edit struck, but uh, it's just too much. Too much of a hassle. Besides, it looks like my struck is being built anyway. It's all good. Maybe I can put it in here. Just being, bring them right in, you know? Maybe. Oh god. Damn, I was really hoping they would take that energy mine. Oh, they're trying. No! Ah, damn it. I really wanted that 22 gone. And just do the Russian strategy again. Work before it'll work again. How's everything working over here? Eh, not too bad. The Omnis are taking care of everything. I don't really need you over here anymore, so I'm thinking of sending you back this way. Oh wow, look at this. Chumped it up. He's dead. He's virus. Boom. Super duper dead. Oh, I think I lost another ship. Yeah, I'm losing all my defenders here. It's because they're getting hit by those dumb MK7. Stray MK7 shots. MK7 is a nasty, nasty gun. Oh yeah, I forgot about this Omni. He doesn't need to be there anymore, either. Alright, Omnis. You guys ready? Let's see if they can do this. I maybe should have given them some waypoints. Ooh! Yeah, they touched a little bit of Struck, which is, doesn't feel too good. Kill that 22, and then we might be able to even start miring. Maybe? Well, we got the energy mine, that's something. Yeah, I don't think the miring is gonna happen, though. Nope. Sadly not. Funny thing is, I think we can build Omnis inside of here. Yeah, we can, look at that. You might not be able to put them on mired ground, but that's not mired ground. That's struck. So I'll move him over here, kill this one. And then see if maybe we can mire from there? Come on, mire, 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 mire! Do it! Do it! I don't think it's strong enough. Although maybe, maybe it is. It actually is. They're trying to unmire with their ships, seriously. What are you even doing? Just try and land them as close to the other Omnis so that they don't die, hopefully. They'll be shooting the ships anyway with their cannons. Well, once they get the miring done, that is. Everything good here? Yeah, everything's looking pretty okay. I wish I could have taken this emitter, but it's a little bit too dangerous to do that right now. What is this thing? 
weird looking ships inbound. Move these guys just a little bit so that we can try and get some of these auto mirers. Make the miring job a little faster. Would be nice. Okay, let's see if I can kill this thing. That would be super nice. And just like that, it is dead. Good. Oh shit. Oh shit, it's trying to attack my lathe. Ah, no! Okay, good, good, good. So that worked out pretty well. I wonder if I can maybe turn this off? Or turn it to on and maybe it will use it on the struck? I don't know if it can. Nope, it doesn't do anything to struck. Oh, that's too bad. Back to adoption ships only. Move this guy over here. Oh, he still can't reach it, really? Fine, go over here. You go over here. You're gonna go way over here. You guys are gonna spread out just a bit. Go there. There. It's all the enemies I have right now, so I'm just trying to get some of these auto mirers so that the miring job is much easier. And then the good thing is, once we get these guns, they're ours. And then they can start firing. Oh, it's going to be amazing. Well, we have to get the gun and get rid of the mire, of course. Why did my HQ just yell at me? It's probably because it MK7. What? What the hell? Where did this gem come from? Oh, I didn't expect another gem. <laughs> That's cool. Oh. Oh, there's another fox virus. Ooh. Sweet. It looks different, too, so it might actually be different. There's a block. Oh, okay, so it's like a hammer in a way. Except it doesn't have the particle beams, which is kind of sad. Oh, I. Never mind. I guess the guns aren't ours. Damn it. That's where the gem came from. Well, that's super sad. That's really, really sad. I was really hoping those were gonna be my guns. Oh well. And then that's what, another grabber? Jeez. Good lord. Get rid of this damn struck. Hmm, where's that port? There you are. Come over here, and then I'll put you down here. You won't be fed, but it'll be alright. I don't really know what else to do with my gems. I mean, I guess I could get mine cannons, I suppose. Sure, why not? I could get this thing over here to get rid of these auto mirers, or at least some of them. Because if we can get rid of some of these, we'll start miring on our own. Really? Give me energy, thank you. I just need to get rid of some of these auto mirers. And then we can start miring. It'll be fun. Because this stream right here, it should mire it really well. In fact, I'm gonna do a double... double attack. Bring the port down here. Oh yeah, I forgot that the headquarters was still out. That's probably why it took a straight shot. That makes sense. Alright. So now we should be able to start miring, I think. Because that's a lot of particle. Oh, sweet. We broke our way through. Awesome. I'm 
which means it's time to push forward a bit. Do a little bit more attacking there, that'll be fine. Oh, that's cool. Maybe it's a bigger virus. A bigger virus ship. And this guy will block with his immense armor. MK7s, though. Seriously, I hate them so much. No, I shouldn't do that. Alright, double laid. Get over here. Let's see if we can take out this emitter now. That would be nice. The MK7s are too, uh, slow. A little bit of a slow. Fuck. That didn't work out well. Wait, I can get a little bit more help. I can get these Omnis to help out. There we go. Help out, Omnis. Oh, they're just trying to mire that? Seriously? You bastards. Well, we can kill this Doppel at least. That'll be quite nice. And I'm thinking we sneak into this space station and give it a virus. Crap. Shit. Damn it. And MK7s, man. Damn it. Freaking MK7s. God, I hate them so much. One bad thing about this double lathe is it just doesn't have very good range. Well, that's good. That's good. It's out of MK7 range, at least. Maybe it can do with this. Yes! That helps. That at least helps. This one's still a nightmare. Maybe now I can do something like this. Viruses, they're not getting in. I'm not traveling far enough. Dang it. Oops. I wish it was a better way to know when it's gonna fire so that you can move right at the right time. Go. Try it. Hope for the best. Well, it did fire. But it didn't make it, of course. Yeah, rip it apart, dude. Rip it apart. Damn it. Seriously? Seriously? My god, I hate these dumb space stations so much. God, these things are such pieces of shit. Both of my viruses are dead. Oh wait, no, one of them's still alive. Oh, there it is. Can you possibly launch the virus in? Launch it! You fuck nugget! You st 
stupid fucking dick bag. Dumb stupid cunt. God, I hate this so much. How are you supposed to beat these stupid fucking MK7s? Just gonna start layering on these because I can't think of anything else to do. I'm losing ships. Yep, I think I lost all my ships. Great. Just fantastic. You piece of shit! Stupid dick bag. God, I hate it when they do that. Now go back to your friends, you dumb piece of shit. But of course he won't. God damn it. I think there goes another one of my ships. One of their ships is virus, but it's not doing anything. It's not ever exploding. What the fuck? These fucking MK sevens. Well, something died. <laughs> And the problem is, I can't use Particle to help attack with him. Because nothing is going to be able to reach it. I mean, I can try, but there's no way it's going to make it. God damn it. What the fuck was that? It's my virus, of course. Why wouldn't it be? Jesus Christ, this is ridiculous. Fuck off, you dumb piece of shit! Stop just running through my ships, you goddamn piece of shit. God, I hate it so much. You know what I could do is maybe build a grabber, like, here? There's some particles collected here. I'm gonna just send it up at him. And then what I could do is send this to the grabber. Might work. It probably won't work, but it might. I need to go get those gems. Kind of important. I need at least one. God, this last part is so fucking impossible. I just tell these Omnis to not mire, right? Let's see, lay the winners. Fire at particles, fire at mire. Don't fire at mire. That might help. That'll at least help with the ships, because they're just going to be firing at this mire forever. It will never stop. And then I'll mount the amp gem there. I'm hoping that the amp gem gives him a little bit more range on that MK7. That's my hope. And that hopefully he can just kill it. 
I sure hope so. He's not even fucking using it. That's well, probably not even hitting. There we go. Yeah, see that grabber's kind of working out a little bit. It'll at least flood those guys. We won't have to worry about them coming in. That's a good thing. What else could I build? Fireflies? Yeah, we'll put a firefly here. Put the bugs over here, just so that they can help out if need be. The virus, I just don't think is going to work out. Sadly, I wish it would, but I don't think it's going to. Oh, man. I wonder if... No, there's no way an Omni can even get there. Great. You know what I don't have, though? I don't have Benign Emergent. Well, I don't think I need Defensive Struck anymore, so I can probably grab Benign Emergent. And then I can set the Benign Emergent to here. And rip him up with some Benign Emergent. That would be nice. As long as there is some... Yeah, here they come. They're coming. I hate the fact they only give me this one MK7 gun, though. It's just not enough. This guy has way too much reactors. Way too many reactors. Shoot. I don't think any of these Omnis can even reach anywhere. I'm gonna try and take them over here. Hopefully they won't die. But if they do, it's not the end of the world, because I can build them over at the other place. And I just wanted to bring them over here, layer them up as much as I possibly can. I'll try to keep these guys safe. maybe the Omnis can help now? I'm hoping the Emergent helps. I mean, he doesn't... Well, he does have a shitload of missiles, actually. God, this thing is a dickbag. I don't we get the one MK7. There's no way I can get that emitter. That's not gonna happen. Damn it. There's just nowhere else to put these guys. Mixers. Get him? Yes! He's virus! Fuck you, you bastard! Finally fucking got him. 
I knew if I could just get him with the virus, I could get him. And that's really all I had to do. It was that simple. Sure took forever though, because goddamn is he hard to kill. Did end up dying, that's sad. Damn it. Are you really gonna kill that thing? Really? I'm gonna run out of energy. Freaking idiot. I wanted it to kill the energy mine. Damn it. At least kill that ship maker. Maybe then I can go inside him? Mm, no. Nope. Inside is too... Too narrow for a ship. Let's see, where's that port at? Where are you, port? Are you way the hell over here? Seriously? Yeah, see, this thing's pretty much done. well be done. Yeah, that should be fine. Yeah, it can feed it energy at least. Yep. Come on. Yep. Energy mine is dead, and now it is mine. Perfect. There we go. I know this isn't the last one, but... We'll get it since we're here anyway. Because I don't think it's just destroy the emitters. No, you gotta destroy everything, I think. Which is totally, totally doable. We just send some of these freaking Omnis over there. Looks like I got room for two, I think. <laughs> that virus. <laughs> Just being kinda random there. There we go. We send these in, it's over. And that's the end. Man, that space station was such a pain in the ass though. Because even though the virus is super awesome, and it really is, it's really freaking awesome. But the bad thing about it is that, um, I'm going to go ahead and get that defensive struck again so that they can have a lathe and get this done nice and quickly. I don't know if I can get all the Omnis. Do I have to get all the Omnis? Thanks for playing! Thank you. It was fun. Very tough, though. Those... those... freaking space stations, man. You gotta get in there with that virus. Oh, That was fun, though. Wait, it's still saying favorites? What the hell? Dumb thing. Anyway. I think that's gonna be the end of the stream. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I had a fun time. Um, but yeah, I guess I'm not going to finish that one story because, man, that is just impossible. I don't understand what to do there. That literally is impossible, I think. Because there's just no fighting back. Anyway, like I said, hope you guys did enjoy it. I enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys in the next stream. Good of us out.